Hi. Hello, everybody. How's it going? Hi, my. I'm sorry. The Twitch keeps giving you Valorant ads. That seems like a personal attack. And hi, bagels. Got saying first. Got saying second. Papo, aren't you still live? Papo, stream. Do your job. That's like congrats on getting a second. How are you doing? Now go out there. How's everybody doing? Um. So, for people who don't know, because they don't follow me on Twitter or whatever, or just don't tolerate my brain rot and my bullshit. Uh, one of the things that I've been working on has been a little thing, a Dharmarampa simulation thing. I know I've talked about it a bunch on stream. <clears throat> I know I've dealt with it, or like I've been ranting about it pretty often, I feel like at this point. <sighs> but I finally got the trailer thing for it done. I'm very excited and I'm very happy about it. And it turned out really good. And I don't know. I just... I made that and I wanted to kind of talk a little bit about like what it looks like behind the scenes because I think it's interesting and I like sharing that sort of stuff with people. I like, I don't know. Also, because this one is a stupid, like this took me a month to make at least. I don't even know how long it actually was like start to finish, but like this was so much and it's three minutes long. I kind of hate myself for it. But anyways, um, so yeah, one of the, let me see, should I do just... Huh. I think what I might do is I might just play the trailer real quick and then also I need to get some water because I just realized I didn't really fill my water before I got here but I'll get some water while the trailer plays and then I'll come actually you know what mm, I'll watch the trailer with you too because I like it a lot I'm very proud of how it turned out anyways I think the volume's turned down a fair bit that's a high shift congrats to getting third all right let me just see let me make sure the volume's not gonna be too loud because I don't know what it'll turn to but okay it's not too bad the song is really really good it's so catchy i think it's the original don wrong anime outro this next for hydration check shiv this bit took me a full day of just making these little cards and like sliding people around in them i don't know what i'm doing That bit was one of the first bits I did too, because I didn't really know what I was planning on doing with the rest of it. Also, part of what's been so fun about this is that there's so many people with such pretty designs that I got to work with, and I felt so proud that I got to have it. Okay, thank you for the sub fossil. Fossil's also in this, see if you can spot them. <laughs> Holy shit, 13 months, that's crazy. Hey, how you doing, Fossil? This bit is so janky if you pause it for half a second at any point in it. It looks fucking atrocious, which is why I'm glad it moves fast. So much pain backwards. Oh no. I don't know what the correct solution to that is, whether it's ice or heat, but take care of yourself, okay? It's heat? Okay, yeah. Apply heat. This one's one of my favorite. I don't know why. I just liked how they kind of like swooped in. I thought that one looked really cool. Oh my god, it's fossil. I wish I could pause this. And then I'll say, Hi Stitch! Looking in! How you doing? It's only been a little while. That one with them in there. I was like, okay. This one with Brandon is one of my favorites because I had, as soon as I saw the like head in a bowl thing, I was like, okay, no, I definitely want to have them rolling over. Again. Also, Kaifers. Kaifers was really fun. See, the game is that is so pretty. Surprise me about it. 
Really not. I feel like if any actual editor saw what I was making, I think... I mean, I know that Sylvie is in this and he's seen it, but I also think <laughs> Sylvie would probably be too polite to be like, I don't know what this one. Fair enough. Also, hi, Coaster. How are you? This bit... Oh, I'm so proud of how that turned. The little spiral thing is what I'm going to be working on today with people, because those are fun. And then that. So that's what that thing looked like from start to finish. I can't wait for the VOD of this to get copyright claimed, but that's okay. Um, I mean, to be fair, also hyper fishy, but to be fair, the Danganronpa games usually do have like one or two characters with some weird designs. Like you've got, what is it, Hifumi, you got Teru Teru, you've got Ryoma, who are, like there's always somebody who's a little bit out of place. So it kind of works on that sense. Gonta is still like, He's just bigger, but he's not like a whole different artistic style, you know? But yeah, okay, so. Uh, all right, I should probably make that layer visible. Where is it? Okay, so. This might make the stream go a little bit janky and a little bit slow because my computer struggles sometimes with just existing with this. So this is what the timeline for the trailer looks like. There are, I think, 90-something uh, tracks to it in total. Oh, wait, it reaches up to 104. Shit. <laughs> because I don't know how to organize things. So, like... Oh, that's I mean, to be fair, some people won't die. Yeah, these were just, like... Like, for this bit. Okay. So what I ended up doing here was, like... There's me in the middle. I mean, this one's just, like, my logo just, like, spinning. It just rotates and moves fast. Coming for me to die first. I'll be in the final round. Okay, so the way it's going to work is like, I've got 57 people plus me. So all 57 of those people are going to... Actually, let me put on like a little bit of like... Just so there's something in the background. Also because I like this song. Chance of living or something. To be fair... Okay, so the way it's going to work is that there's four seasons of this in total. There is... Where are they? We've got... God, I can't remember where it is. This is such a messy thing there's the fall of hope group which is 19 people there's frozen frenzy because it's virtual killing academy so it's like a school season or a school year that's broken up into semesters there's fall there's winter where the fuck are the last ones oh yeah the last one's way up here um, wrong one. This one, Despair Downpour. So there's 19 people in each of these. All of these people are going to be, uh, oh, I don't know, Everyone's so mean. Um, let me just see. Yeah, this PC, I don't, I mean, like, let me just find it. Where is the bit? Um, this bit. I don't know why I did it this way. This was not the most efficient way to do it, but each of the little squares that shows up during this bit, that's a, a separate track, and they all appear one at a time, one frame at a time, which has this really cool effect, but like, it, my computer straight up can't show it. Like, like it just freezes whenever. <laughs> also, I don't know if it froze the stream too. Um... But yeah, so the way that the All-Stars format is going to work is that there's 19 people in each group. Uh, there are going to be six survivors from each group. Each group is going to have a mastermind. It's not so, like I didn't plan really any of this in advance. I just kind of put people into the simulations. And the only I did reset them a couple times, but only if it was like if it was doing too many double kills, because that kind of kills the fun of it. If it's just like every like if it ends too soon, I kind of wanted them all to be the same sort of length and kind of have roughly the same like structure to them, I guess. Um, and also, if it was just my friends who made it to the end, because if you uh, where are they again? Um, oh god. If you look at, like, the full roster of them, most of them are about, like, 50-50 people I knew in advance and random people. Uh, so I didn't want it to be a thing where I was like, hi, all of you random people, sign up and, like, jump through all these dumbass hoops where it's like, send me your artwork and send... Because they had to... Like, they would send me their model art, and then I'd have to make a silhouette of it. Some people have multiple pieces of model art, so I have multiple silhouettes for them. Like, Jay has this pose, which is used... Where is Jay's? 
here it is. So that one shows up here, but then there's also this one, which also has to have the pink eyes because I didn't know what I would use where. So they just kind of all have to be part of it. So Jay's shows up in the back. These are also, again, don't ever pause if you're watching this one because you'll realize that everyone's proportions are horrendously fucked up because none of these people are drawn in the same style. So it's all over the place. Um, but yeah, so I reran the simulations a few times to see if I could get like a reasonably fair distribution of everything. Uh, I didn't want to have it just be like a bunch of my friends because it would run simulations where it'd be like the survivors are like Puppo, Apollo, uh, Jay, uh, Tarth, Leo, and uh, Daz or something like that. And it'd be like, okay, well, that feels like kind of shitty for all the new people who like who don't know me and signed up for this. And then like if they die first and then all of my friends make it to the end, they're like, okay, cool. So like this was kind of just you gassing your friends. Like what a lot of Smasher passes end up turning into. So I reran them to make sure that they were pretty evenly distributed. There's six survivors from each group. One of them became a mastermind based on their behavior. So like depending on if they were voting really weird, like because the simulation randomizes it. It's through a site called Brant Steel, I think. They have a bunch of like survivor and stuff like that. So I uh it's purely random. There's no logic behind it. It doesn't like try and determine who was the mastermind or like who would make sense. It it just randomly gets everyone to vote for everyone. And then when they when it all shakes out, it basically just says whoever got the most votes must have been the blackened, and that's kind of how it figures it out. I did see them where I'm actually I kind of want to play it on stream. I just have been so busy. Uh, yeah, so like they do like Hunger Games simulations, they do Big Brother, Survivor, um, and all that stuff. And it's very basic, like it's a very rudimentary thing where it's just like uh, you put in all of the names, you can pick people who are already there, you can do like a custom one. Um, and it'll basically just say like a body was found, X is dead. And then if there's two people dead, it'll just show which two people are dead. Then it'll say a discussion ensues, voting ensues. And then everyone randomly votes and then whoever got the most votes or like if it's tied, because it usually ties because it's, you know, it's all random. Then it'll just like pick one of the people who was tied for the most votes and say like they were the blackened, they got executed, moving on. So uh, it's all pretty simple. But wherever I could, I tried to find a pattern of someone, like, someone that the simulation was making act weird and would, uh, would make them be the mastermind of it, just because in my own head I thought that was funny. And then all six of the survivors from each group are going to join up for the, like, the all-stars one. So, six random people from this group, six random people from this group, and six random people from this group, which gives us 18, and then I'll join them. So it'll be 19 of us total, because I thought that would be fun. Because I I also felt like I didn't want it to be a one and done thing. I thought it'd be more cool. The survivor class. Yeah, well, I mean, I guess that's kind of what the the future arc of the of Danganronpa 3 was. But yeah, also, this took me fucking forever. Do you know how hard it is? There's, again, 57 people. Because I didn't include myself because I'm in the background with a little Junko outfit. No, no, because Yeah, I played it a little bit. I haven't really gotten into it much because I've been overwhelming myself with things but like it was a really good time it seems like it'll be fun uh what was i saying oh yeah no so like each one of these is just on a separate layer and like they're all just plain black high <laughs> life potato uh because i thought it was funny and i don't know why twitch has that uh art of me and the jingle outfit where is it it's here this one was done by let me find them um the name is lev They make a lot of very pretty art. Um, there's every stream has one person who discovers the the mpreg tag at this point. But yeah, so I made one of these little like character intro screens because if you played V three, you know that they have this sort of like. Actually, I can show you the one that I made for myself. So use it as a stinger whenever I'm playing V3. Uh, this one, I think. Oh, that audio was... That was some chunky audio. Why are you looping? You're not supposed to do that. Stop it. Was that Kyoko? Yeah, the stingers are very fun. So that was what we were going to do. Um, yeah, it was very crunchy. I apologize. I don't know why it does that. Wait, I can... Um... Now oh, whatever, we'll figure it out. Crisp and crunchy, yeah. Yeah, it happens. Um, 
I think I have a version that's not like the full thing. It's just the, cause the problem with it is that it's a, it's transparent video, which I think makes it a little bit harder, but I think I have it. Uh, where is it? I just had to find it earlier, but I can't remember where I put it anymore. Um, Uh, wait, actually, where? Oh, right, it's in like the wrong file for some reason. Okay, so this is what it mostly looks like. Hold on, I'm giving like, or, like what it looks like in action if it'll ever. Yeah, like that. <laughs> That's what it's supposed to look like when it's not fucking melting itself. But yeah, so I'm going to be making a few of those for people today because I think they're fun. I'm also going to be making a few little silly ones because they're funny to me too. I think it was, um, because when I made them all for people, I sent them out to everybody who was like kind enough to loan me their models. Um, and I think it was Sylvie. Yeah, Sylvie was the one who, um, DM'd me and was like, hey, that's cool. Can you make a custom one that says these other things? So I have, I made him one that said, uh, like just... Sylvie Ultimate Dipshit, I think, was the one. Like, Sylvie Spark Ultimate Dipshit. And then uh, he asked me to make this one because it's just something he says a lot. He uses that as a reaction image on Twitter a lot, and it's always funny to me to see. Because <laughs> he'll just be posting it in response to some dumbass shit, and I think it's so fun. Um, but yeah, and so then after I put that one up, a few other people were like, hey, could I get a version like that? Yeah, you can request him. I'm going to be... Um, we'll see what we can do. Yeah, Sylvie's cool. I was, I was surprised that he joined up for this, but he was like on it immediately when I first asked for submissions. It was cool. Six of March. Yeah, I think some, I think multiple of my friends stream under it. <laughs> nice bagels. But yeah, so I'm going to be doing some of the like stinger transition things. Let me see if I can, where is it? What did I change? No, we're not changing anything. I don't want to fuck with whatever I did. Uh, also, it'd be easy. You can also just DM me the requests if you have them. I'm going to primarily be doing the ones for people I've already made them for, just because then I already have the assets and it's kind of plug and play. <laughs> Thanks, Bagels. I don't know if that's true, but I appreciate it. But yeah, this file is also might be more chunky because there's a lot going on here. Because just for context, okay, let me put that in performance mode real quick. So for each one of these things, <laughs> There is the name. Actually, let me see if I can show it in the folder. Uh, you know, we can use Althemia. So Althemia, we've got her, her picture, her PNG. Maybe okay. Wait for right now. It's not a Drag Race format. It's just a reality show format for reasons that are definitely not related to how any actual dog with things work. I promise. But yeah. So you've got Althemia. Wait, I'm gonna just snooze the ads. Just uh, so there has to be the picture of the person, there has to be the background for the person. Each one of these, I did it really ineffectively and put it in the, um, like just made it like this instead of just like, I don't know, because I couldn't figure out how to make it export from Photoshop. Then there's the lines, which are some people's colors. I could have gotten more creative with this. Like if you watch the, actually, hold on. Um, if you look at the real ones, hold on, I'll pause the music. Wait, let me just make sure this doesn't have like my personal details in it. Give me one sec. Um, where is it? Let me hide for more for half a second. Because a lot of my screen recordings are just like doing whatever. Um, um Okay, I don't think that has like my real name or anything in it. Cool. It's like zoom in. Uh do, 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 do. okay. Hi Monokuma. Yeah, we're doing some of the Dong Rompa stuff. We're having fun with it. Have you seen the trailer's in the pinned comment if you want to look at that? Yes, it's him. Um, I don't know if I could pull off a good radio voice. I don't think I have that in me. I think I just sound like this. I can't do much with it. Um 
where is it there we go but yeah so like this is what it looks like in game if it'll play so you can see like it has like different colors and stuff and i didn't do that because there's 57 people i don't have a monokuma type figure i was kind of thinking it might be fun to have one but also like i just don't have the energy to do more than i already have because i've already bitten off way too much smoogie is literally the first one that shows up when you google like dongrumpa v3 intro so that's why it's her but yeah and so i took that and i basically just like put it on top of or like just put it in here and then was like layering everything else on top of it you're easily impressed. Hi, Ryan. Thank you for the follow. How you doing? It's fine. Don't worry. I know that it sometimes happens. You know what? That's why we use Smoogie. Because I wouldn't disrespect the others by fucking with my editing with it. Uh, but yeah, so like it has a little glitch effect as it comes in. Moves over to the side. The silhouette moves a little bit differently. It like slowly zooms in. You can see just the pink eye like just peeking out. And then it zooms back into place. And then it glitches out. And that involves 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16 layers of stuff happening. Um, but now that I've got it done, because I just like, I would have these like 50% opaque and just have them like running on top of the smoogie one. So I could like line up roughly where everything is. But now if I wanted to add it in somebody new, it would actually be pretty easy because a lot of this stuff. Sorry, it's going to be the same regardless of who's doing Also, I guess I needed some movies because I used the audio from hers. And since there's nothing on the background, it can be exported and used as a stinger. So I'm going to make a couple of those for people. We'll use... Where's Puppo? We'll use Puppo as the example for this. This isn't... I mean, the original one was a lot... Like, the actual trailer one's like 108 layers or something stupid like that because I hate myself. Um, yeah, so we'll grab Puppo's just i don't remember which assets i actually need for this thing so we'll just pull all of them over and we'll see yeah something like that so yeah okay so some of these things are universal so like this ink top thing that one is used on all of them same with the ink bottom same with all of the like revolver bits the main things that are going to change are the background the lines the name and then the silhouette obviously and I do this in a very scientific way where I just... Actually, hold on. Let me turn the music back on so it's not dead. Actually, what's a better one? Hold on. Um, can I go back to the album for this, actually, pretty please? Where's a good one? Um, no, not that one. God, there's so many of these that are way more high energy, and I appreciate that. But also, I would like something a little bit more chill. Where's anything? There's like 60 songs in this soundtrack. It's a lot. No. Sure, we'll do this. That works. That's good vibes. Also, I don't think the... Sorry, Stitch. I didn't uh, mention that earlier, but I don't think the finale is out yet. I hope Lemon wins. I've been a Lemon stand forever. I think she was done dirty in UK versus the world. I think she deserved better. So I'm glad that she might have a chance this time. And also, because frankly, I don't want another American to win Canada's drag race. <laughs> Fuck off with that. We barely get anything. Let us have this. So what I'll do is I'll just drag the Papa one and the Viv one and have them sit basically in the same spots. <laughs> so valid. So we'll need to take the Papa one. So we're going to move it to... Actually, I think we'll just copy-paste these in, and then we'll tweak them as needed. This is how I did everything for the trailer, too, which is why the trailer gave me Carpal Tunnel. That's not correct. We need to size them up a little bit more. Maybe not that much. We may move them a little bit higher and just go with this. Actually, wait, how does he look? Where's the waist on both of us? Part of it is that Puppo's arms kind of throw me off. Uh... Sure, why not? We'll do that. Um, 
So then we'll put a keyframe there. And then we put a second keyframe. Because this one is both. Actually, I guess we should probably also put the um, keyframe for this here. Because then he needs to move over there and very slightly increase in size. By like, I think I, yeah, I did it by about nine there. So we'll move him over. We'll go with, I don't know, which is not like correct proportioning because obviously like he's zoomed in differently, so it'll work differently, but whatever. Yeah, so now they both move in, but then the Viv one zooms. Also, I should probably put the transition effect on there. But that's just the glitch blocks. Also, keep in mind, I know this is like amateur as fuck and extremely janky because if you've watched my video essays, that's the extent of my editing before like a month ago. That's why it looks like that. Yeah, I don't really know why they're not going all in on Global All-Stars. It's weird. Also, let me just put this here. So, Popo, zoom in, and then we need to go up to here. Actually, we might also just turn down the opacity so I can kind of see the movement. Because I think when I did it with Smoogie, I mostly was trying to align the eyes. Actually, it's probably the better idea is to align the eyes here. We'll put... Actually, that does kind of work better. And then we'll move you... We'll align mostly the right eye, I think. We'll use that as like the reference point. Do this. Again, this is usually how I have to do it because I don't know what I'm fucking doing. Also, I did it up. I did it up. Okay, but I don't know. It's... Sure. I don't know. We're just vibing. So now we're going to put you here. I don't think that the, yeah, the X and Y move like very, very slightly over to the side. And it zooms up to 294 from 287. So it was like seven-ish percent. So here we go with 43. And then just kind of I don't know that that looks lined up and then this just returns back to the original position i believe right uh, yes which makes that easy because then we just go back here And then we put the glitch box in for Peppo again. And then look, now it's done. Hold on, we'll put the Viv one back here so that it actually shows. You know, we'll make a little preview render so you can see. We don't need to render the whole thing, just this bit. But yeah, oh wait, I should probably turn on the opacity. That's on me. <laughs> That's a skill issue. So yeah, now Peppo will... Easily impressed. Thank you for the follow, Rocky Froggy named Ghost. Welcome in. Yeah, so now we've got that. Let me just copy. Yeah, actually, we're gonna move this over so I can copy paste this and just make a second version of it. So now you can see how it zooms in. Looks very pretty. We're gonna replace because all of these are just they're set to be yeah multiply and overlay. So like that's why they show up the way they do. They show the background through it, which means that instead of having to like recolor everything, I basically just can do this. Just swap out the background, and it'll all look pretty in the end. So this was just yeah okay that's pretty easy. Put in this over here, turn this to zero. Putting in another one. There we go. Easy peasy. Lemon squeezy. I look sweet and you look sleazy. So I'll just delete the extra background. Uh, 
Um, let me make sure that other shit isn't showing up on here. Okay. I always get so anxious whenever I share anything that isn't a game because I'm worried that other things will be there. So now, we might have to adjust where Puppo sits based solely on his arm getting in the way of the name, maybe, but we'll see. So we'll take you two and just do the same thing we did before. We'll just mess with the angles and everything. Oh, we probably actually do want to have this over our background, though, don't we? Maybe. <laughs> otherwise, I can't see shit. Put you here. God, no, stop. Stop changing the song. You don't want to listen to Dead Body Found A. Leave me be. Yeah, I know you do. That's the problem. Um... All right, we need to put it at the exact same coordinates as this. So it'll be one, because the shadow has to start out directly behind him. That's the problem. What do you mean, what do I mean? That's the same proportions as this, right? Or 225, 1, and 695. Yeah. Actually, we might also bring the puppet one over here just so we can, like, kind of line all of them up. And then we'll just put the opacity on both of these down a bit so we can kind of make sure. Actually, it might be a good thing to also not have deleted the Viv thing so we could use it here too to kind of indicate where we're looking to line everything up. It's probably smarter. Okay, I should have done them both at the same time, honestly. That would have made more sense. Anyways, we'll just add in these at the times where they need to exist. So yeah, the Papa one doesn't move, but that's okay. It'll move shortly. We'll make the Viv one transparent too, because I need to be able to see where the eyes are on that one. So. What's the scaling different? A fair bit different. Okay. So. Oh, wait. Let me just zoom you up. Where are the eyes? Okay. So then... Yeah, I shouldn't have said that the way I did. Whatever. We'll figure it out. Um, because this one is at about 275. Let's see what it looks like if it's at 300, give or take. Mm, that's actually pretty close. I don't know. We'll make adjustments once it's like all figured out. Just want to make sure. And then this will just zoom it back into place. Cute. Opacity up to 100. Huh. I think this is where I need this to be. No, I don't think I actually did that right. Uh-oh. Again, yo. Here. Where is the... Any of these lined up with anything? That first one should be lined up with this. Okay. Nope. Let's not break everything. How about... Oh, it is lined up. Okay, cool. So... 
Um, let me run to this. I also need to run to the bathroom real quick. So I'm going to run an ad, get that out of the way, and then we'll come back and then I'll show you what it looks like when it's done. Because it's almost there. It's getting there. Okay. Be back in a second. Okay, okay, we're back. <laughs> Realizing that I could run an ad for two minutes instead of one is so nice, because then I don't have to run panicking back. Okay, wait. I don't know if the calibration's right. Whatever, we'll see. So anyways, now you've got Buppos looking like this. But obviously, that's the wrong name and the wrong color. And I'm also really worried that I actually am going to have to adjust this more because his arm is getting in the way. <laughs> we'll see. So we'll grab a spare one of these just to see. Because this bit's easy, because it's just a transition in. Where is it? None of this is organized. So what is this? Transition transition four. I love very professional names, you know? Editing work is really it's interesting because on one hand it's like it's very utilitarian and kind of boring in that sense but also like there is something really cool about like when you can pull off the effect you're looking for where you're just like oh i get it now i see that was my feeling with so much of the trailer thing too was just like oh, it works i'm just gonna keep that in there make sure it's all lined up let me just delete that one and now it looks a little bit closer to correct but we don't have buppo's name we have mine So, I'll just delete these. I don't need to be here now. We'll grab my name. We'll grab Papo's name. The transition is just wind. I can't remember. Oh, there it is. That's convenient. But yeah, I'm not going to make like one of these for everyone. I made the like animation for everyone because that one was pretty easy to just like swap in the different effects and everything. But other than that, it's so, so simply not worth it. Um, yeah, okay, so that's all those. And then we need to put in you, 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 and then you, you, and you. There we go. 
Excuse me. So now this one needs to be opacity of 50. Needs to be zoomed down to about 80. This one I can kind of standardize because they're all like a full, well, I guess like uh, 720 instead of 1280 or uh, 1080, but like they'll all fit the screen the exact same size. They should all pretty easily kind of map onto each other, which is nice. So then the Puffo one, oh, that's, so yeah, back down to 80. Oh, that's why I'm dumb. 116 to negative 51. Okay, this bit didn't actually need to do this. It just needs to have the opacity turned to zero. There we go. Now that should look basically identical. And then the name will shrink down. Perfect. So we can delete that one. Delete that. And then, is there anything else that needs to be changed? I think that's everything, isn't it? Let's render it. Well, I just have to adjust it, but we'll see. Okay, okay. So, hold on. Let me turn off the music for it. Fuck, it does cover his name. Shit. Okay, we're going to have to move Papa over a little bit more. God damn it. Okay, well, at least now we know. We're going to bring a second Popo and also a second Popo silhouette, just so I can make sure that I make the adjustments consistently. Because, like, I think they both basically just need to be, like, I'm going to just move you over here and then move you... Uh, Five, seven, eight. We'll hide those two layers and see. Does that still hide the name? Yes. Fuck. You know what? I'm just going to zoom you over and up. Because I think the main thing is that it needs to go up more. I think that actually does leave the name visible. It's just that it's like hidden behind the shadow now which is okay because then because this one didn't show the shadow either right yeah Ooh, the shadow does not need to be that big actually wait did i why does he look so much bigger i don't think he should be that big Here, we'll just put him like right. Actually, we probably do need to keep it the same size. Hold on. Yeah, we'll do that because otherwise it'll also fuck with the rest of them. We'll just like try and. Oh no, it definitely is way too big. Did I up it by that much? Because he needs to be basically just like slightly visible around him. He doesn't need to be like giant around him, right? Let me just see what I did here. Yeah, this one's basically just like popping out a little bit. Whereas like on this one, yeah, I think that's mostly what we want. So then, I'm gonna just drag the opacity down on these so I can kind of see what I'm looking at here again. So this needs to be more I don't know if that actually helped. Yeah, we just need you to like move. Because like, where were you? That's what? Oh, negative 738. I don't know where I got that number from. But yeah, so that would mean that... 
color just grows a little bit. We want him to be over here. And then this one does not need to be 300. It needs to be like maybe 360. Nope. It needs to be 260 because I'm dumb. And I forgore. We'll hide this so I can actually see what the fuck I'm looking at here. The only problem is I want the eye to be visible at some point. But because of the way that Pebbles pose, I don't know how easy that'll be to do. Because this one, this one he just like peeks out a little bit. So how do I do that with Pebbles? I sure that works. Or we could have it like, I don't know if that looks right. Yeah, because then it's like sliding downward, which isn't really the idea. Um, I have it like just peeking out like that and see if that works, I guess. And then it just has to zoom back into place, which is pretty easy. Okay, opacity up to 100. You two get deleted. We don't need you anymore, I don't think, I hope. Okay. I shouldn't have started with this. I just should have started with something easier. Whatever. Making the little, like, meme ones that don't move. Or even that move, but just aren't, like... That don't have a bunch of keyframes and shit is really easy. This bit is just unnecessarily hard because I make everything difficult. Okay, let's see. Yeah, that one works. Yeah, there we go. I like that. All right, so um, what can we put behind it that would like show it working as a transition? We'll do that, and then we'll do this. I guess I don't know. Here, let me just like cut it to here. I guess I don't know. We'll see, and then we'll render it real quick. It should be pretty fast, and then it'll look like a transition shot. Thanks for the hydration check, Bustle. I haven't kissed any boys in ages. I don't know what you're talking about. Oh, wait. I guess we probably need to mute that so it's not just dulling up the audio. But look at that. Now it's a singer transition. And then I will... Just... Export this bit for bubble. We'll do in. And we'll do. Usually I don't do my videos like this. Usually I would have them be a little bit more like more of a smooth transition, but uh, or like I wouldn't I wouldn't have it be all choppy and just like do random projects within one thing. But I just there's too much happening in this one. But yeah, now Pebble's got one. I should have asked him if he had like a actually wait. Bubble is still alive, right? I should have asked him this before I started. But oh well. Scarlet, how are you? <laughs> I just went into Pablo's chat and said check your DMs. Cause I'm gonna see if he does have 
one like that. I don't know why I don't have one saved a bit like that. I would I could have oh maybe I do actually. Hold on. Let me see if I can Oh no, it's probably in a group chat that's gone now. Because I don't think Discord saves all those messages. Fuck. Huh. It's alive. You know what? That's what's important. And you made it to the end. Um This is something else. Where is it? Uh, I don't know where that went. Hmm. Anyways, we're going to export this one of Puppo. I don't think you guys can see the export screen. Okay, so I won't bother explaining it. But we basically just have to do... Wait, what is the video format that works for this? I need to actually check and see. Um... Worship Academy Academy, up a bar. Why did it say it's an MP4? It's not an MP4, huh? Weird. You should be the export screen. Don't worry, it's not impressive, I promise. But also, wait, why is it not? It is the video format. Because I know I have it. I just don't know why it's not. It's uh, It says that it's an MP4, but I know for a fact it's not. Because MP4s don't allow for, like, alpha layers. It's a human layer. What's up with all the microwaving? Um, yeah, like, it says that it's an MP4, but... Oh, no, and that one's an MP4. Let me see. Where is the... No, this one also says that it's an MP4. What the fuck? But it's not. Am I going insane? How am I forgetting this? Thanks, Papo. Hey, Papo, hold on. Before you go, if you're still here, look at it. <laughs> I just wanted to get a regular full body one so I could maybe make it a little bit smoother because his body's currently in a weird pose. But we'll see. Um, browser. Oh, also, it doesn't need to be trimmed. I think that's good. I'll just put it in paint.net. Oh, I can show how I made the, uh, the pink eye versions of them too. I've been like for almost an hour and we've done one of these. Okay, so I need to like pick up my pace if I'm gonna do more of this. Ah. So this is the one of Puppo with this. But what the fuck is the transparent video? Okay, wait, I found the same tutorial I used the first time to figure out what the fuck I was doing. Uh, where is it? What was the setting that this guy picked? Um, huh? Oh, I see. Okay, I got confused. Let's try this again. Go for the same thing. Uh, make sure there's not other settings that I need to like turn on for this. I think everything is right. Okay. So then we just have to export the alpha channel. And then pop I don't microwave. <laughs> Keep saying this, but one of these days someone's gonna believe you. And then what am I gonna do? Alright, let's export this and see if it works. It would have been easier if I just started at, by asking Puppo, but oh well. It's 48% converted, also there's. Mm -hmm. 
There we go. Okay, let me just... Say that word on Twitch, you'll get banned. Okay. So now it should be done. Let me see. Well, I'm gonna swap it in for mine for a hot second here. I shall probably the LGBT say that. community is rich in sensibility, sensibility has, has excellent, excellent taste, and is full of talented, talented artistic, artistic people. people. Well, thanks for the jacket redeem fossil. Prepare to be humiliated. Okay, well that's rude. I'm just a little guy. Um, so let's see if the Peppo Singer will work. What's okay. wrong? What's wrong? What's wrong? Hey, what's wrong? Hey, 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 hey! Okay. <laughs> I forgot that I'd added that one. Anyways, so now we've got one of these for Peppo, but now I have a different version of him. So, let me just... Actually, I'm going to save this so it doesn't, like, crash and ruin everything. Just save real quick. I don't actually need to... That would be fun. Uh... Okay, we'll show... There it is. There's Buppo. So, this is Buppo's model standing. Wait, actually, what's the... That should be fine. Okay. So let me just save him, but also make sure that you guys can't see that window pop up. Party. Okay. Um, oops. Okay, that looks like that's working correct, I think. I don't know, anyways. So I can't ever remember what my settings were for making them turn pink, but I have a file that I named CPS, or, yeah, CPS shift for pink eyes. So what I would do, it's this, yeah. So you do this, max out that, and then it's negative 58, 155, 11. And then that gives us super pink bubble. It might be no. Hold on, let me just see what mine look like so I can kind of compare and make sure that it will be the right like resolution. Because if not, I can always just ask. Mm. It might be a little bit too low res, actually. I might have to ask Pebble for a different one later. We'll see. I've already made him one anyways. We won't save the changes. But... That's how I would do it. And then I would actually, to get the effect of this, I would do that. E, because then it's going to all single tones so that it's easier to turn pink. And then control A, C, make a new layer with the same thing. And then he shifted to go pure black. And then just like erase out the eyes. I'm not going to actually do the whole thing, but like. Basically like that, and then just turn up the opacity again. And then look, now he's got the pink eye. Anyway. I'm not going to save that. But, let me see. Um, there's somebody else who I was going to do one for. Uh, oh, Hikaru, I think, was one of the people I was going to do it for. Wait. Where is his stuff? Her design is really pretty. Also, it's one of the ones that's like very bright orange, which I really like. I like that color a lot. So we'll just do the same thing with his. We'll grab it. We'll drag it over here somewhere. This one is just the like leftovers one, so you don't really need it. 
and that as well. We can just delete all of those. Uh, and this is just the leftovers from Pueblos as well. Why is it up so high? Oh, right, yeah, because that thing's clicked on. Well, let's unselect that. Okay. These ones, they're easier to do the animated ones when they're like, it's just the default pose. Like, that was why I was wanting that from Puppo. Also, let me just send Puppo his version real quick. Um, where is it? Two hundred eighty-four megabytes for that thing, Jesus! For a three-second clip, no wonder it gets janky whenever I try and play it on stream. Oh well. Anyways, so you've got Hikaru's. We just want to do the same thing with this one. So I'll grab another copy of the Viv. Put his over here. Why am I saying his? That's me. Sorry, I'm having a little bit of psychosis. I hope that's okay. Um. So what we're going to want to do for this, because the proportions are going to be a lot more similar, it'll be a lot easier for us to just like grab you, transitions. Also, yeah, I should say the way that it works on like the default ones, we've got the names and there's these things. This is just like a marble texture that I got from uh, the person who made the original template online. And then the actual like white revolver chamber. And then they both have a different effect. So this one has a multiply and this one has an overlay. And the marble also has the mask of this shape so that it'll like replicate it. And they just both rotate. The marble texture just makes it so you can actually like see when this, like the outer, because there's two rings in there, the inner ring and the outer ring. The middle ring has like, <laughs> excuse me, lines cut out of it so you can see that one more. But without the marble texture for the, um, inner ring and the outer ring and I guess it also goes mostly transparent but like you can kind of see like it doesn't look like it's rotating at all because there's nothing there but yeah okay so I'm gonna grab you Oh yeah, I think that was why this was like this, was because it was like, this is a good, like, static starting position. Also, wait, do I always have them scaled the same? Wait, hold on. No, I didn't. I always had them scaled the same for the other thing, but not for this, probably. Um, also, let me just grab a background so it's not sitting on empty air. Hmm. Yeah, so we put that there. Then we need to put another one of these here. And since we just need to drag them both to the same spot, I'm just going to do it like this. I don't know why mine isn't like symmetrical with this thing, but whatever. I probably just fucked it up and should have fixed it before. Whatever. Honestly, we might end up using Hikaru as a template going forward because it should be directly centered and I don't know why it isn't. But whatever. Anyways. I guess my Puppos was a little bit off base. Okay, so now this one goes up by like 278 to 287. So it goes up by like 9-ish. So I'll have you go up to like 245 for take. I'm gonna make that a little bit bigger actually. 
just because the proportions are a little bit different. I want it to mostly, like the size of the head, I want it to mostly still be the same. Maybe like 252 question mark. More like 260. I feel way bigger. Actually, wait, how did it line up proportionally here? Okay. Wait, did this chin? Yeah, wait, this should be like way bigger. Why is it not like. That looks about right. Um, so that's you, and then your shadow needs to initially be like, how much? Okay, so this is already two seconds, that's like 300 or something. Something silly. And then we'll just... Continue moving this around. Where are the eyes? There are the eyes. It's kind of the only thing we can work with on this one. Makes it a little bit harder, but that's okay. Good enough. And then we need to put uh, one more set here. Because. Did I not increase? It only goes up by like, what is that? 287 to like 294. So I went up by like seven for that one. I think a little bit more for mine. Cause I feel like Hikaru's face was not, I mean, Hikaru's a little bit bigger than mine, I think. Maybe too much. 278. That looks mostly right. And then with this, just drag him out. Easily impressed. Thank you for the follow, B Pat. Welcome in. That's too big. This should come down a little. This is how I did it when I did the original one, like laying over or like uh, overlaying it on smoothies. Is just like trying to line up. I think it was the eyes that I used for that one too. Oh, that was the incorrect. There we go. Like just trying to make sure that the eyes had the same sort of general layout. I was doing a little bit of editing, making some fun little stingers and stuff to take a break from the trailer that I was working on. Oh, I guess that'll break. That's fun. I like how sometimes it just decides that I'm grabbing and rearranging my taskbar instead of the thing that I actually was doing. Okay. And then this one's easy because we just have to bring it back to the starting point, which should be... Two, zero, negative seven, eight, I think. Yes. I'm gonna grab some glitch blocks, just throw them on there. If you've ever watched any of my video essays, you've seen the glitch blocks because they're what I use for a transition like 99% of the time whenever I need to like draw someone's attention to something. But, okay. So now this one should be done, question mark, I think. Yeah, okay, cool. So we'll turn off the opacity, make it look like normal again, and we can delete these. Yes. Um, so let's render it real quick, get a preview. Okay, so let's... Look at that. Isn't that fun? Isn't that silly? Okay, so now we just do the same thing that we did before with all the other bits. Grab the name. Uh, the transition is originally wind, which is somewhere in here. There it is. Sk 
scale, position, opacity. Scale, position, and opacity. And the last one's just opacity, and that one goes down to zero. 80, 116, and negative 51. Negative 51. Easy enough. Also, we'll just edit in the background and make that look correct. Zero. And then 100. And then zero again. Okay, those are lined up. Actually, wait, we'll wait to render it until we've got... Because I know we only need the lines, and the lines are easy enough to do because they're just a... Simple... It's Rustic Transitions 4. How could I forget? Alright, let me grab that. I think this one's already the right... Yeah, defaults. Okay, perfect. And I can't remember where this one lines up with. That's with the first line, okay. Oh, perfect. That is where it's supposed to go. Cool. So, now that that's done, and these ones are no longer necessary, we'll get them out of the way so we can try and render those. Okay. Such an underrated character. Yeah, so now we've got Hikaru's. That one took way less time. Well, I guess it's because I wasn't doing anything else. Look at that. Oh, hey, it's Leo. Yeah, so now let's export that one for Hikaru. And then we'll do some other stuff because I don't want to just be doing this. Yeah, well, that one was also because, like, I wasn't trying to explain the whole process or whatever, and I kind of, it's, once I've, like, got into a rhythm with it in general, it's a lot easier to, like, kind of get them all out. It's really just, like, the first one of anything, or, like, getting back into it that takes a while. I don't know why it turns into an MP4 just with, like, alpha, I don't know, that's weird. Should I see if I can find a different one? What's a different thing here? What's this one? God, I wish I didn't hate the Monocup so much because I do like their like theme. Yeah, exactly. So, we got one for Buppo, we got one for Hikaru. I don't know if there's anyone else that I wanted to do one for like primarily. Oh wait, Zobby! I was doing one for Zobby because Zobby's back uh, streaming now. Oh, also, something fun is that I made commands for everybody. So, for Popo, look at all that. All of his links, his ultimate, the artist who did his stuff, and we've got one for Hikaru. I don't have these just for like when people die or get executed or whatever during the simulation streams. I want to be able to be like, all right, go follow this person, be nice to them. So everyone's been very sweet and very helpful with all of it and put up with my bullshit while I've been working on this. Yeah, okay, so let's see. Where's Zabi in here? Uh, Zabi, Zabi, Zabi. There you are. So actually, you know what? let me show you my favorite color in all of these. I don't know where Vike is. But Vike has like... Because some people have like a very clear color for them, but a lot of people don't really have a specific one. Like... With Mo, for example, it's pretty obvious that, like blue is kind of the color to go with. Um, God damn it! Bad bot. 
Uh, but yeah, so like some people like Mo have a really obvious one. Tarth has an obvious one in his normal art, but this is a different thing, so it's a little bit different. Um, what else is here? I think kind of most people in general have a pretty obvious one. I, oh, uh, yeah, uh, yeah Nansme. Their design, I love it. Hold well, on, let me see if I can find like the full piece for them. Yeah, this one, I, this one was really, really cool. I like this a lot. There were some people when they submitted for it, I was like really, really hoping that they would respond when I asked them for more details so I could include them because I was like, it's like their designs and Nance was definitely one of them. It's so good. Um, yeah, I had to adjust Nance Mace also because it's a very dark red. But where is Vike in all of this? Because Vike is, he has like a wine red kind of purpley color that I really, really liked. Where the fuck is he? Oh, there, oh, he's right in front of, yeah. He's right in front of his eye. Like, look at that. Isn't that such a pretty color? Like, ugh. this one was one of my favorites. I don't even really know how I ended up with it, but it looks very good. I don't, I'm sure I pulled it from his design somewhere, but I don't remember where. Where is, like... Oh, I pulled it from that little stripe on his pants, I think. Like, the second one from the bottom. I think that's the color it was. And then I just, like, tweaked it a little bit to make it work. But it, it oh, looks so pretty with this. Anyways. I'm gonna grab uh, Zobby's. Zobby's is also gonna be a little bit difficult for the same reason as Popo's was. Because it's not, like, a standing straight up pose. Which is the easiest one to do for this. But... That's okay. Pubbles is also like. Part of what made Pubbles. Oh, wait, shit. It's gonna keep trying to play different stuff. Don't do that. Um, Actually. I don't know what any of these sound like anymore. Um. Okay, where's like a little bit of a better one? Oh, fine, whatever, we'll just do this. Yeah. Hi, Zeke, how are you? So we're gonna grab this. We'll do the background first because I kind of like to be able to see the background. Uh, we'll see this. Oh my boobs wake up, it's Chase. How are you, Chase? Okay, so I'll put zombies in here. It doesn't look great with the green, but we'll figure it out. Um, we'll keep this over here just so we can use it to like translate whatever we need to, I guess. I think we'll do all the other stuff and then we'll do this till last. Because then at least we kind of know what we're dealing with there. Do, 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 do. So there's a pretty aw. No you. You're a lot. You know what? You think therefore you are. That's why I don't know what I am, because I don't fucking think. I just keep doing shit. Uh, I think this is the one. Yes, perfect. Okay. So we delete this one. And then we need to grab the zombie name. What is up with the bots? Jesus. Someone remind me to get Saribot. This is the silliest guy ever. Silly, so true. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. I Every time it happens, I think to myself, I do need to get Saribot. And then I don't. And then it happens again. And I'm like, damn, I really should get Saribot. And then I don't. And it's a vicious cycle. I think this was 80 question mark. No nope, wrong thing. I didn't want to grab that. I'm 
Wait, what? This is not the position this is supposed to be in. Wait, what? Hold on. Did I like fuck this one up somehow? No, this one does have the right setting. Weird. I don't know why this one got like fucked up, but. Oh, I think it was Reese. Oh, I think that's what I did. Okay, hold on. Let me just like delete this and grab a different one. Yeah, I see. I think I just like kept on adding in new things on there, which is what I should not have been doing. There we go. 116, negative 51. There we go. What else do I need to swap? I think it's basically just the model now, yeah? Yeah. Okay, let's see. 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 Let's What if we actually, maybe this is how I did it before, roughly. Okay. So what if we like to make five on you and just zoom you up to like here. I didn't do a very good job cutting zombies out, but that's okay. Where are... Oh, right. This one does need to be zoomed up a little more. I'm dumb. Uh, for like 250, I guess. Okay, so I guess it's like the top of the eye is like... Okay. There we go. Alright, and so then... correct okay and then we'll add in another one here and another one here So what we'll do is zoom it out a bit. And we'll see where this lines up on here. We'll just move it down here. No oh, damn it, fossil. I don't know if this is really gonna work. I wonder if I ask Zob if he has a more transparent version of this. Or like a better cutout of it, because I kind of just manually had to do it. Right, we need to also move you. 
Um, Four and negative five fifty. There we go. We'll render it. We'll see if it looks okay. And then I got this. We'll probably just do some of the more like the silly Photoshop versions of it. I guess I don't know. Okay. Hmm. Yeah, that looks mostly right. I don't know. It doesn't need to be like perfectly symmetrical with the other ones because like ultimately they're not going to be seen in comparison. As long as it looks good by itself, then like that's fine. Yeah, I don't know. I like that. Actually, let me just also delete these old ones that don't need to exist anymore. This, let me go in, and that means that it'll collect everything. Make sure I didn't leave anything from me. No, okay, good. So now we just do the same thing. We export. Um, mm -hmm. And that'll just take a second, but then we'll be good to go. Oh god, I'm opening the wrong program. Also, please tell me I did. Okay, good, I did have that open. Perfect. All right. So, now that one's done. And look at that. Now I've made three of them. I made a Popo one. I made a Hikaru one, and I made a zombie one. And that only took however long that took. Might as well probably close this, because I don't think we need to be doing that. We'll go into Photoshop and we'll make the other things. I don't know why it shows that screen. I would prefer it if it didn't. Whatever. Okay. Um. So good. <laughs> I'm just zooming. I mean, yeah, I, part of it is that also, like, I'm not getting distracted talking about stuff. Yeah, so this is what like the very basic version of this looks like. I probably actually should one. Maybe open up the because I was using this whenever I needed to just get a background, a name, and like a uh, the lines for people because I would just recolor everything. But let me open up a proper one so I can use that because that one. Oh, okay. Please don't be showing that. Good. I don't know why Photoshop is automatically defaulting to showing NSFW art. Um, is it in here? Uh, I can't remember where it is anymore. Also, okay, I need to run to the bathroom because I've been chugging water and an ad's about to run anyways. So what I might do is just play the video, like the trailer thing while I'm gone and I'm getting more water anyways, and then I'll be back in a second. Oh my god, hi Squidgy, how are you? Yeah, we're gonna play the trailer, I'm gonna go piss and get water and then we'll get back to it and we'll make some of the silly meme ones. Like the one that, where's the selfies again? We'll make some of these ones. Because there have been a couple of requests. I got one from Tenchi that was like, can you make me one that says kill yourself and i was like no tenshi i don't think i can i don't want to get in trouble for that where was that oh yeah he said okay or, okay can i have one some generic version of kill yourself and i was like okay so no not that and he was like i can't have any fun <laughs> tenshi's so silly maybe i'll make him be silly anyways but yeah okay i am going to start up the trailer where is it to be creative i mean yeah exactly maybe we'll dm him and see what he wants anyways okay
So I might get muted for a hot second now because I'm a fucking moron. Anyways, um, <laughs> we're gonna play the trailer and we're gonna run the ad. I'll be back. <laughs> Hate myself. Okay, we're back. Hi. So I get to watch this. It's too. It's hi, Mitsu. Thank you. I. Uh, I have watched it on my own an obsessive amount of times. I feel embarrassed. That's why hydration check for today. Oh, okay, wait, I wish I could pause this, but there's no way to like... There's no way to pause it, but if you did during that bit, you can sort of see there's like a pattern to like... They're like... Positions 1, 3, 5 will like black out and then 2, 4, 6. I feel like that Demi submitted that art piece for this too, because usually Demi, for people who don't know, Demi has like um, a bunch of different recolors, or just a bunch of outfits in general. The Reaper, that one, there's like one frame where it shows his name as the Reaper instead of Kaifer. But anyways, um, yeah, usually Demi has like sort of three, or mainly black and white, but then like a red version and a blue version. I don't know, I really like that it's like this sort of like white and light pink version. I guess we'll see Demi's normal art in the next, when we're doing the Photoshop edits of him. God, I can't believe that I was able to do this for this many people. There's so much. I like that it ends on that too, that was fun. Anyways, okay. So, oh, it wasn't too stuttery. Let's see. Photoshop, are you being an ally right now? Sure. It did. We'll do a little dance. It was, yeah, it was like, um, actually, I can show you guys, because there's a bunch of people here who weren't before. Let me show you what the editing timeline for this looked like. It's such a disaster. Because I also don't know what I'm doing is a crucial thing to remember. I have never edited anything like this. So it was really just like fucking around with all the, like the, um, and also I use Wondershare Filmora, which is like knockoff version of a video editor. Like, I don't know. I think there's like one person I know who uses it. I don't even know them. They're just like a content creator, but like, <laughs> it's not very popular. It works fine, but it's not very popular. So like, there's not a ton of tutorials for it and stuff. Um, sorry, it's gonna take 45 minutes to load in because it's slow and bad. There we go. Um, but yeah, so there's no tutorials and I was just using all the like the default effects and transitions and stuff. But like this is probably the like, 
Why is this cut? I don't think this should have been. I don't know why I did that, but whatever. Anyways. So like this is all just the background colors, which just have different masks on them to like cut out. So like Tenchi's and Sylvie's, Tenchi's is the one on top, so it like rotates to get out of the way. Uh I think Bonnie's would be the one with the mask because it's on top, right? It should be. I think maybe they both do actually for this one. No, just Bonnie's. So like Bonnie's looks like this, but I could always just slide it over or slide it back. We'll undo that because I don't want to fuck with anything. Um but yeah, like all of these are just like random static transitions that were in here before and i don't really know how to like do it properly so when i did this it was i applied it to like one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve i don't know wait how much Fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. Yeah, it's like twenty-six of these, because which is not how you're supposed to do it. You're not even really supposed to use it. I think like on a blank end, you're supposed to use it to like transition between shots, like how this flash here is being used between two separate things. But I don't know what the fuck I'm doing. So that's just how I animate out basically everything. Wait, this is, okay, it is lined up. Thank God. I was like, fuck, did I forget to fix that? Um. Yeah, it's a mess. Some of it is that it kind of, I mean, I guess I could have condensed more of it into these like composite clips, but like at that point I would just be making it more confusing for myself and I don't think it'd really be worth it. Um, but yeah, like uh, this bit, for example, is just like the different silhouettes all lined up and then they all just cut in at their own times. And they have, I tried to make it look like they were all blinking. So it's like a, a fade wiped down, but it doesn't really work, but whatever. And it opens and shows all of them. And then you don't pause on it because they all look <laughs> really disproportionate to each other. Um, there's this bit that I was talking about for this little, like, the little block bits where each one of these comes in in a different frame, which means that it's a nightmare. Also behind that is the Junko outfit just zoomed in. I used it a bunch of times. I didn't know what else to put in the background a bunch of, for a bunch of these. But I think it turned out cool. These are honestly probably the bit that I think look the best. This is so much fun to me. They all just move in a different direction. They all have like a square or the, all of the, like the characters themselves are, oh wait, I should probably turn on some music or something. Uh, they all have like a color burn blend, which is why they do this. Cause if it was normal, they just look like this, but obviously that doesn't really work. So they color burn onto their own thing. And so long as they're on the lowest level behind any of the other blocks, because the blocks themselves are solid, then they'll just be hidden and it'll be fine and they won't burn onto the, the gray behind it for whatever reason. I don't know what, I don't know why that works the way it does. I'm assuming because there's not really color in there or something. I don't know. Anyways, uh, the problem is for ones that are higher up, like May. Also love May's design. This is so, where's May? Hold on. Uh, this is a May's Frozen Frenzy, right? Yeah. Isn't this so pretty? God, let me scroll up. Jesus. Like, I don't know. With VTubers, I feel like a lot of the time there's like a... Let me stop zooming in on the cross. Jesus. Um, yeah, I mean, design is so pretty. Like, I love the little, like, uh, Fuda, I think is what it's called. It looks very nice. But yeah, with a lot of VTuber designs, there's obviously, like, the bigger is better. Like, always doing the most. And I love that, too. Like, Julian, Immortal Monarch, doing the most. It looks amazing. But, like, Maze is very, like, stop doing that. It's just such a, like... It's very subtle colors and I really, really like it. It was so pretty. I don't know. It's so cool seeing all these different designs and like, I don't know, picking like a color for people and stuff was always a little bit challenging. Cause like trying to decide like with May, like blue feels like it's the right one. That's why I went with that for her, but also like the yellow and the little flower. It's so good. I don't know. There's just so much here. Jay kind of also has like a bit of a more like Jay's does a lot, but it's also not like a million colors like it's all very intentional i could guess what you this is why i didn't want to do it as a smasher pass because i thought that would be kind of boring because i i like most of the designs i see but sometimes i see one where i'm like i don't like oh wait uh who are some of the other oh fubuki fubuki's is really really good the colors are very pretty to me i don't know this it's like a very like pinkish orange color also, Death, Death Mom got a redesign uh midway through this so i'd done most of his i think i don't know if i still have the original one 
in here. I can probably drag it in though. Um, but I saw it and I was like, wait, do you want me to update your thing? And he was like, yeah, sure. Uh, but then it also meant that I had to like go and change it in a bunch of different places. And I was really happy because the old design is really good too. Where is it? Here. Like this old design is very good, but like the maroon color in this is so pretty. I don't know. I was also fossils, obviously iconic. They are the moment now. Come on now. <laughs> Not everyone who's part of this is a VTuber. Most people are, because I was kind of like, that's the sort of, I guess, circle that this would go around in. <laughs> yeah, so let me just see uh, if I can find what fossils, because I also sent out a little bit of a Google form for everyone to like answer with like, what's your name, pronouns, like, you know, are you okay if there's anything like related, like anything that's like off limits, like what's your sexuality in case where like someone tries to seduce someone kind of as a joke sort of thing, like what would you be comfortable with, whatever. Uh, send me your PNGs so I can use them. <laughs> Exactly. Fossil is a winner, baby. Um, actually, I wonder if I can find... Wait, actually, I can show it in the stream, probably. We'll see. Um, instead of having to drag more stuff into there. Also, we'll just... I don't know. I'll, let me finish the point that I was doing, then I'll show you what the voting screens will also look like. So what I was going to say about May is that because May's is on top of everyone's in this, if it doesn't, if, if I didn't have a mask on it, then she would end up overlapping into everyone else's, which doesn't look as bad for hers because she's obviously like kind of off to the side anyways. Uh, where's Rain? Rain. If Rain didn't have this, be just like on top of everybody's stuff. Like this is what it looks like without the color burn or anything. Randall just like slide across the screen. But if we do it like that, then it works and it's all smoothed out. That was a lot of rambling for not much. But yeah, all of this stuff was just like a lot. And I really like it. I'm so happy about it. Oh yeah, right. The where is it? Um, not this groups. This groups? No, before that. Where are you? God, see, this is the problem with doing it like this is I can't find anything. There we go. Um, it's like this bit. This one's a nightmare because the way it works is just like, it'll just spin and then it'll slow down and it'll just like pop them in. And they're just like static cutouts that have a circle mask around them to make sure they don't like cut into each other's spots. But they're just there for a couple seconds and then it'll just like spin up again and it looks really shitty when you're seeing it like this but when it's moving fast you barely even notice it just shows them for like you can't even see who all that is there but like with this one wait let me make sure this is not like i don't know why it's like it keeps on trying to like zoom in weird anyways uh if you see like Rotenshi and may and i think uh aria are the ones who get no no i meant uh sylvie hikaru and uh, stara they all get blacked out, and then their spots will be replaced by Vike, Mint, and Looney, and then Tenji, Arya, and May will get blacked out. And it just like wrote or it alternates so that everyone can get fit in. I think everyone fits in in this one. Oh no, I think Fossil didn't. So Fossil got in a little bit here as like a quick shot, and then it just cuts through all the rest of the little silhouettes. And it zooms out, and then it's just all these things that are. I don't know. I guess it's below. Yeah. Each of these just like slide in from the side. And then they just fade out in time for the next one to come in. And it just moves so fast. Like, again, it looks really janky when you're seeing it, like, up close, which is why I thought people wouldn't like it as much. But then when it's moving fast, it's kind of moving too fast for anyone to see what's wrong with it. Um, anyway, we're going to close this. We're not going to save it because I can't remember what changes I made and I don't want them to be preserved. Um... But also, wait, did I, I thought I did the voting screen, but I don't know if I actually saved it. I don't think I did. It's probably in here somewhere, but I can't remember where. Uh, media file. Oh yeah, okay, cool. So I'll have this. This is like the background. This is made by uh, Airbus, who I will grab the Twitter for. You can actually, oh wait, no, yeah, I'll grab the Twitter quick. 
um this is actually from a vr chat world there's like a whole uh airbus made a 3d model of the v3 courtroom and then also made a vr chat world with it which i think is insane and very cool um but yeah this is uh their twitter and let me see if i can find the um there it is if you use vr chat world or vr chat this would be really cool to check out i really recommend it it was fun to wander around it i don't really i don't have vr so it's not like the same effect for me but highly recommend looking into it if you do anyways let me just close firefox again anyways yeah so he was when he made this and uh i put a little bit of a filter on it just so that it, each one has a different um like each season of it has a different sort of tint so despair downpour their color is green so there's this one um and let me see if i can find a voting screen for boss actually wait, i wonder if i can make like a slideshow and kind of show what it'll look like image slideshow Um, oh, wait, did I not go back and fix these? Oh, fuck, I haven't fixed them yet. Oh, shit. Because they're supposed to look, like, transparent in the back, but I guess I didn't do that for whatever reason yet. Oh, well, that's kind of disappointing. Um, I totally thought I had. Wait, actually, what? fuck it. Give me one second, I'll just make them. Because they're basically done. I just need to like save them as PNGs, which is annoying, but whatever. Oh, right. Also, I forgot there's also a uh, other thing that needs to be added in. It's the overlay thing. Where is it? Here we go. Me back here. Okay. Oh god, this is lagging out. I shouldn't have opened up eight million of these all at once. Whatever, it'll be fine. So we just need to remove the background and the overlay. And then that and then I need you to stop making that noise PC I don't like it Also, you should see what the voting screen template things look like. If you thought that the video tracks were bad, there's hundreds of layers in these things. And it's miserable because Paint.net is also not built for this shit. But also, I don't think Premiere Pro is built. Nothing is built for this shit. I'm doing bullshit. Okay. 
So how's everyone's day been? How are you? Getting there. True. I mean, like, the thing is with most of this, I know that I'm being nitpicky with my own work because obviously like, I've had to stare at this for hours and hours and hours of my life. So like, of course, my understanding of it or of it is not going to be like an accurate or fair one to myself. But also like, you know, part of why the trailer I think looked good is because it, I took that approach with it, I guess. And I think that the rest of it will also look good if I take that approach to it, where I'm maybe a little bit hard on myself. But like, I don't know. Better to be hard on myself and not have needed to be than to not put in enough work and then feel really guilty when it looks like shit. I should have made a proper Don Rumpus stream playlist before. I'm going to be making one for when I do the actual streams, but whatever. There's J1. What I really should be doing is playing Marvel Rivals because I'm part of their like, um, their creator program, and they're doing a playtest right now for uh, Gamescom, I believe. And I'm part of that, and they gave me like a special server download and everything. And then I have not had the time to play it yet. And it closes in a couple days, so we might have to do that a little bit tomorrow. Because they've got new characters. They've got it was a Captain America and Winter Soldier, I think. There's Leo Shi. Leo, there you are. Oh, Luciana was another one that I really liked. The design is very pretty. There's so many good designs. He is. Where is this young? I haven't even seen it. Like, I. Whenever I get, like, into a real hole of the project where I'm just, like. Like, with the inescapable video, it was this way with the study, like, the gaslighting study thing. Um, even kind of with the return to die video, but I feel like that one wasn't as much. I like don't do anything else. I wake up, maybe eat breakfast, usually just like caffeinate and then sit down on my computer and just like work on either writing, recording or editing or whatever other bullshit I'm up to until it's time to either stream or go to sleep. It's also part of why I sound a little bit frantic right now, I think, because I'm sort of getting towards the end of any of these projects is a little bit like, oh no. What if it all went to shit? What if no one's gonna watch it? Like that was the big thing with the inescapable one, although that one I'd mostly resigned myself to no one watching. But I was like, I've spent probably hundreds of hours working on this stupid video and it's ruined my brain like i'm gonna need to like go to therapy for this and no one's gonna watch it because like who the fuck would care about a three hour long video about a game nobody has played and nobody wants to play it turned out a lot of people <laughs> Mm 
I don't know how, many, how long this is taking me. I apologize. I'm just just showing paint on it. I just want to like surprise you. I should have been playing the trailer in the background. That's what I should have been doing. Whatever. I wonder if there's a limit to how many times they let me play that trailer before eventually they just like actually get me in trouble for using copyrighted music. Um, where is the... Oh, I guess it didn't... Oh, wait, never mind. There we go. Okay. Now, let me see here. Come on, Streamlabs. Oh. Uh, this is going to cooperate. There we go. Okay, so it'll have to go behind this. Also, I think that fade is probably not correct. Actually, let me hold on. Um, transform, reset, transform. Wait, why are you all? Oh, the background video is the wrong size, but everything else will work. Okay, that's fine. I'll just have to reset it in a second. There we go. Yeah, that's basically what the background is going to look like. Sorry, this is not really worth it for just showing this, but like... Mm, really like... I think it's a little too fast, actually. We might just leave it at that. But yeah, this is sort of like the background, like, sort of like before anything happens, this is kind of what it'll look like, just sort of like cycling through everyone. Because also, I want people to be able to see the art. I want people to be able to sort of have some time to like look at what all is there. I want the people who are part of it to also not feel like they're just being like skipped over, especially if they die early. Because they'll still appear in the rotation even if they do die. They'll just have they'll have dead written on them in big pink letters and they'll be grayed out, which I find really funny every time I look at it. Um Right, we're gonna do the other thing. That's the incorrect thing that I hid. Don't do that. Hide that. There we go. Um Right, we're gonna make some of the Photoshop ones. Okay. Oh, hey, is you. Uh, there we go. So this is the template that I originally worked off of. Also, let me just grab the link for that because I didn't make this. Somebody else did. And I was very appreciative that they had it just like uploaded on DeviantArt as like a thing you could just use. Um, but if you'd like to make your own, the link to it is right here. I had to make a couple of adjustments just because mostly for um font because I don't have whatever their original default font was, but I'm working or I'm figuring it out. Um but yeah, so as you can see, you know, example name. Who was somebody who wanted one of these actually? You need to stop closing this. Um Hopefully Firefox will stop burning up all of my RAM, but I doubt it. Oh yeah, Demi wanted one. Demi wanted one and uh, uh, Felix wanted one. So we'll do Demi's first because Demi requested this like a while ago. And I kind of was just like, I'll do it when I get a chance. And now I have a chance. So also let me make sure that you guys can't see it when I try and open a file. Okay, presumably you guys can't see that. And if you can, I don't really know what to do about it, so. Let's pray. Okay, you should be able to see that now, though. Yes. Party. Okay. So, we've had Demi. We've had Demi Silhouette. I don't know why Demi Silhouette has like a bunch of. This is one of the weird things that I noticed when I was actually working on this, is that like a lot of these people have like, there's sort of like transparent bits that didn't really get filled in or whatever for whatever reason. 
uh, when the artwork was originally being made. And like, you can't see it on any of this. Like, it doesn't show on Demi's artwork. I don't know. It was sort of interesting. Because also, like, I can't actually tell where that would be. I guess that would be like on the straps here. Weird. Either way, it looks very pretty. So there's nothing to worry about. And then we take this. And the person who made this put these in as sort of like guideposts, basically. So you could like uh, put your giant Demi on here. But also, let me actually just get the artist because I did make these. Fanny. There you go. I think that I think this one was Bowsy, I guess, because it doesn't look like a glitch piece to me. Anyways. So then we would just zoom. Actually, we probably take both of them. Yeah, we probably should have taken both of them and just like move them together, but that's fine. We can always just set the proportions to be the same. I'm not allowed to move. Let me rotate up. There we go. Obviously, like Demi's pose isn't like a static straight up and down one, so it's a little bit off. But that works. That's mostly on the right spot, right? So I'm going to do the same thing. A little copy. Why did it? Like, oh, fuck. Why does it keep on like doing that? I've... Maybe I just like click out of it so it actually like saves. I don't know. Okay, good enough. I don't know why it was. I don't think I've ever had to do that before. Weird. God, now I don't know how to like set it to the same proportions as before. Damn, I'm sorry. I tried. Good enough. Okay. So now we'll put that in. We'll basically just copy paste over. Why did that change? Okay, you. Why are you not? go Christ okay um nine fifteen there we go um wait fuck it won't let me the slide Till roughly the same bits are sticking out on the edge there. Move it up. We can hide both of those. See if we need to adjust Demi a little more. I think it's sticking out a little bit too much in that direction, not enough in that. Also, I don't know how to get rid of these grids. I don't know why that's there. It just showed up one day when I was working on this and has never gone away. So, already. Um. Also, just gonna have to check really quick and see what Demi's color code for the background was. Um, I think it's this, give or take. Might be a little bit off because for whatever reason, I didn't save these as like separate things. I just made a whole bunch of the same thing. Um, Oh, wait, no, I know how I can check this, because I can just go to the text. Where's Demi's text? Mm -hmm. There we go. That'll be the color. It actually is still the same, whatever. Anyways, so now I'll change the background color to match what I did for the rest of Demi. And then for the bars... Uh, layer style, I think it was, oh, okay, Christ, uh, color overlay, um, blend mode was normal, 
It's this. And then it's 50% opacity. So it still kind of shows the gray through. Did I make that the default? And then it's going to be really slow and janky. I hope it's not like dropping frames on stream. If it is, I apologize. Photoshop doesn't like me. We don't get along. We're not friends. Um, but then we just do the same thing on this. Uh, yeah, reset to default. Demi's is one of the more subtle ones. Again, if they sent in one of the more like uh dramatic colors. Or like if they send in one of the like more dramatic recolors or whatever, then it would be different. But I figured, I don't know. It also stands out compared to like a lot of the other ones that are very bright and colorful. I kinda liked having this one be sort of What's the word? Cleaned up, I guess. Anyways, um, what was it that Demi picked for their thing? Demi wanted. <sighs> Let me just change this color real quick. Any guesses as to what Demi would want to put? Um, this was Demi's request. So I'll just export this as a PNG. I'm just making a new folder for these. And now it's done. So, does this show if I minimize it? It does. Okay, that's fine. Let me. Send that to Demi really quickly, actually. Where are you, Demi? There you are. I hope they like that. Uh, and then who was the other one? It was uh, Felix wanted. Uh, where is it in here? Oh, this should be all caps, whatever. Did I, I didn't type this in all caps, did I? No. Why don't I have caps lock on? Um, bitch. Okay. So now what we'll do is we'll basically just hide the demis again these back up there and then I'll also have to, oh wait I guess I oh I should probably I don't mind it's still showing okay good um I hate trying to maneuver things in here I'm not used to it okay uh let me open up get Felix's color because Felix is different I can't read where is it there it is and that's not the one I even needed. I need the name. Okay, so for Felix, this is the color that we need. Oh, I didn't copy them. I'm not very smart. Okay, hold on. 
this is the color that we need. Which is nice. It's sort of a like orangish brown rust color. I like it. And then we'll do the same thing. We'll go into the color overlays. If it'll ever fucking load. Photoshop, why are you like this? Why does Adobe have to be the default program that everyone has to use? It sucks ass. I've never met anyone who likes it. Or like any other stuff, really. Let me just reset all these to the default that we've now set. Did we see it? No, probably not. I think Demi's streaming right now, actually. This process would have gone so much faster when I did it the first time. It was purely because this fucking program is so goddamn slow. Uh, okay, so Felix's was... You... Hello. None of my friends are normal. And we just swapped that one. That was the last line. Uh, put up your dukes. And now we just need to open up the Felix versions. Where is Felix's stuff? Oh, Felix isn't part of this group. That's probably why. Felix is part of this group. And for every reason, I have these ones in separate folders. So give me a second. I mean, true. I think normal friends probably wouldn't let me do this with their... I mean, really normal friends probably wouldn't be VTubers to begin with. But, you know. We're just gonna del I should have kept all these layers the first time around, but whatever. Actually, no, we won't delete it. We'll just keep it hidden. It's fine. Um, so we've got Felix, Silhouette, and now Felix. Now, can I grab both of you, do you think? Do you think it'll let me? It will let me. Oh, that's super convenient. Why didn't I do that before? Felix is one of the difficult ones because Felix obviously has like very broad shoulders with his design. So he's not like going to fill in the head block the same way that the others do. But that's okay. I think this was mostly how I had that uh, position before. So then we'll just take you. Slide you over. I think that's mostly where it needs to be, question mark. Uh, we might move it a little. I'm not sure. I think it looks mostly about correct though, right? Yeah, I think that's right. There we go. And then I'll just save this. I don't know why either of these would need to be saved, but anyways, let me just, we don't need to keep seeing Photoshop. So I'm just gonna close this real quick. Cause I don't think there's anyone else who requested like a silly one. I guess Tenchi. Maybe I'll make, you know what? I might make Tenchi's. I don't know if I should make that on stream if I do make it actually. We might not do that. That might get me in trouble. But yeah. I don't actually know what else I would do right now. Uh, let's make another one of the... Uh, or a couple more like stinger cut-ins, I guess. We'll see who's we can work with. So I'm going to change the song so we can listen to this for like an hour. Um,
things just have to load in. Give me a second. Oh god, wait. Oh wait, who won Candace Dragons versus the world? So the clip just came up on Twitter. Okay. I'm not gonna say anything about it because I don't wanna spoil it either way. Anyway, sorry. What was I looking to do? Right. Um, since you went for Fubuki. I think she also actually requested one, so that would probably be fair to do. Because so it's mostly like, I think what I pretty much told people was like, yeah, if you want something, like I can do one for you. You just have to ask me for it. I mean, to a certain extent. Not like guaranteed, but like. Because ultimately, like, I am doing it for free. So I can always be like, don't expect me to do all 57 of you. Hold pause. No. No holding pause. That would be parasocial. Fubuki. There we go. It's not always a catch. This is here. It's different. just cut this move this back here whatever um oh good night fossil thank you for stopping by also it still throws me off that you changed your color for your name I'm not used i'm used to you being uh green right you're so fancy schmancy now change it back uh wait how do you change your color wait isn't it just like you um how do you do that? Wait, hold on. I haven't changed it in forever, so I don't really remember. It's Prime. Anyways, yes, good night. Oh, it's in the, if you click on the badge next to your name, like where it says send message, and you'll change your like identity or your chat identity, whatever. Anyways, good night, good night. Thank you for stopping by. We're gonna go too much longer. Basically just until I get tired, I guess, or until I get hungry. It really could be either or. Okay, so that's, Okay. This is definitely way smarter to do it from this end. I don't know why I was doing it the other way before. Uh, Rustic 4, isn't it? That what it's called? Yes. Or Rustic Transition 4, whatever. I do truly fear an actual video editor ever coming in and looking at my bullshit. Oh god. Wait, what is it playing? What the fuck is this? What the fuck is Mind Mine? Did I memory hole one of the fucking mini games in V3? Honestly, I might have actually. It sounds like something I would do. Where is it lined up? I think it is where I had it before, right? Yeah. Hey, Gojo. Evening's been going good. How's your evening been? I'm just... Oh, it's just like a truck outside. Jesus, I was worried there was more thunder. There's been a lot of storms lately. Um. Okay, so that's Fubuki's colors. I'll grab Fubuki's name next. Okay, that one does just align pretty nicely. It's the mining mini game. There's a mining mini game? Wait. Oh!
Oh god, I did memory hole that. Fuck, I hated that one. I fully didn't remember that that was a thing. Nice. Should I take a nap? Yeah, sounds like a pretty good day. Let's get the uh, wind one goes in here. Oh, wow, man, that's so true. Okay, and then... Eighty. Uh, then sixteen, negative fifty-one. I think, right? Yeah. Perfect. And the opacity needs to go down to fifty. And then at the end, one more opacity down to zero. I don't know why I did it this way. I was not to reason why. I was about to do and die. All right. So now. We have the fun silly bit where we have to figure out where the fuck to put Fubuki in all of this. I think what we're going to try and do actually is just drag the two of them together at all times and just kind of go from there. So like... Mm. I'll put this at zero because I want you to be actually centered because for whatever reason mine isn't and I'm kind of mad at myself for that now. Um, and then I'll put another one here. Uh, I'm making little stinger intros and stuff because I was doing the Dongamapa trailer thing. And so I was like, you know what? Let me make more of these for people because I like them. I hope they like them. Um, did I not? I guess I had her chain going a little bit below where mine was, so we'll see. Where are the eyes lined up? That was what I was using before. Oh yeah, I guess that's not really super useful for this level. Um... Yeah, they're mostly... Oh yeah, that is the wrong position for her. Hold on. It shouldn't be like... It should be like the... Actually, no, that's pretty much where it should be. Uh, oh my god. Did I not turn on the... Oh my god. Fuck me. I... So sorry. I forgot to turn on the layer. <laughs> It's been like 10 minutes and no one said anything. I hate it here. <laughs> Anyways, I'm... <sighs> like it's been a long day. Maybe that's why people weren't watching anymore. <sighs> Anyways, look at this. Now I've got most of Fubuki's done. And you guys didn't even see it. You should see the final bit, I guess. That'll have to be worth something. Let me... Maybe that's a bit... Oh shit. Oh no, I'm sorry. It's a calamity, or it's a, what's it called? Um, Comedy of errors, not a calamity of errors. I'm not very smart. Uh, negative 29 for that one. Let's just hide these two. Uh, 
No, it's like not. This needs to be zoomed a little less, I think. And then grab my glitch blocks wherever they are in this. Feel reliable. Okay, ads should be over. I apologize for that for fishy. I, ugh. this is why I don't tend to do this sort of like streaming on multiple things. If I had a second monitor, it'd be a lot easier, but like, you know, this is full screen right now, which means this is all I can see. So I don't even notice that the video or the thing isn't done. Also, that does make more sense, Kojo, when you were, because I was like, what do you mean? What am I editing? I'm editing the thing that's on screen. And it turns out, no, <laughs> there was not the thing on screen. There was nothing on screen. All right, so let's render this real quick. Actually, hold on, let me delete the extra stuff so it doesn't try and render that too. Prepare to be humiliated. I'm gonna hide the next. I already humiliated myself. I was streaming for like probably at least five minutes. I don't know how long without the screen even being active. But look at this. Look at that. Fubuki's doing you know, pretty good. I've been making these little stingers and stuff. So there's the one for me, which is like one I've had for, that I made a while ago. And there's one I made for Papo, which is a little bit wonky because art isn't straightforward. It still looks really good, I think. And there's Hikaru's, and then there's Zavi's, because Zavi just started or came back, which I'm very happy about. And then Fubuki's. Wait, did does Fubuki not move? Oh, maybe that's part of the issue. Cause like, I was thinking like, it seemed like the maybe it's like 280. Uh, yes. Everybody who's been gotten one of these is a VTuber. Not everyone who's in it is a VTuber, but most of them are. That looks a little bit better, I think. We might move her over a little more as well, just to have the like zoom out effect look a little bit more dramatic. And we'll also do that. And we'll even bump it up to 300, because why not? There. That looks a little bit more dramatic. Also, the next would you like one? Because I can do your stuff. Absolutely. Hell yeah. That looks better, I think, right? I like that it keeps on defaulting. It goes back to a random point in this each time, and I have no idea why it picks Daz right now, but I think it's funny. <laughs> Anyways, let me just export this one real quick. Because I promise I have to cookie some other stuff for this, and then I forgore. Let me save also real quick. But yeah, you can actually use this as a real stinger, which is what makes me really happy about them. They're like, they genuinely work for that. Uh, Final Plus. The one thing that's really fun about these is that like, because you have the alpha uh, layers or whatever, I can't remember what it even calls it. Um, these end up being massive files. Like this is a three second clip and how big is it gonna end up being? Let me see. How big are these usually? About 300 megabytes, give or take. Oh, for Bookies is 333. Which is insane. Keep in mind, like the entire trailer video thing, that one is that one's 476. Like, it's kind of stupid. I don't know why they're this giant, but anyways. 
Sites for bookies. Let's move it over a little bit so it's out of the way. And then copy another version of me. Because I am the blueprint. And then we'll grab Lunex from in here somewhere. So I need to run to the bathroom. We'll see. Where's Lunex? Where's the cutie? Um, I think over here. Yeah, there you are. Because you're part of the later group. Also, I love the color for yours. The red turned out really good. Incorrect. I have found you. So, there. Get fucked. <laughs> Anyways, let's drag you over here. Okay, and that's what it takes. Yep. See, look, now it's got that. Wait. Yeah, this much is always like that, huh? It does like last a little bit longer than the rest of it. Yeah, V2 is kind of, it's a weird thing because like, it's definitely not for everyone. And anyone who has been doing VTubing for even like a little while will know people who spent a shitload of money on a very expensive model that they like used twice and realized they don't actually like it that much and stopped. So like it's one of those things where it's like it's a good idea to like get a PNG, uh, like a reactive if you want to try it because a reactive PNG. I mean, uh, Lunix has one. That's what this is. Or I guess this one isn't the reactive PNG, but you do have uh, reactives that are like basically or it's through Fugi, right? Um. Yeah, you can use that to like kind of dip your toes in much more affordably because like VTuber models get to be expensive and see kind of if it's something you like. And also like lots of people, it's not even just like a transition step. Plenty of people are just PNG tubers and that's what they do and it works really well for them. I.e. Lunex. It's okay. Don't worry. I won't. <laughs> Honestly, I don't want to test the video editor more than I already have because I feel like it's going to break shit soon. Uh, okay, there we go. We got Lunex there. Now we'll do the name. But yeah, like, or actually, if you've ever seen my, wait, do I have the, I don't know if I have the Fugi thing active on stream, do I? Uh, let me see. Where is it? There it is, the little Fugi reactive. <laughs> hi Demi, welcome in Raiders. How are you? Hi, hi, I just made a thing for Demi. I don't know if you should. Uh, welcome in Raiders, welcome in. My name is Vivras, variety streamer. I play a whole bunch of stuff, a lot of visual novels, a lot of uh, shooters, stuff like that. I also make video essays Reason over on YouTube. Impressed. Thank you for the follow on Eternal Nexus. Welcome in, Cloudy. Welcome in, everybody. How was your stream? Oh, yeah, should I just do the shout out? Uh, is... So I pimped in. Yeah, it is, Demi. Also, I fucked your dad, got held by Automod. Um, uh, let me give a shout out for Demi real quick. Also, Demi, would you like a singer? Oh, how is Pokemon? Uh, and also, if, I also make video essays over on YouTube. If you like that sort of thing, you should check it out here. Right now, I'm just doing some stuff because I'm doing a Danganronpa simulation thing. Uh, wait, I can show you guys a little bit of it. We won't watch the whole thing right now, just because... Actually, can we? I'll watch a little bit of it. But I made a whole trailer thing, and then I'm making other stuff as part of that for people, because at this point, I kind of just need to, or else I'll go insane. If I'm to fuck that, right? Very fair. Is it a Nuzlocke? Oh god, it's already lagging. I don't like this. Don't fuck the Pat Rat. Just hit the Pat Rat with a rock. I wish I could skip ahead. Wait, uh. I could kind of skip ahead to Lunex's bit. Or Lunex. Oh yeah, Lunex and Demi are in the same card of this, aren't they? Wait, we'll get up to that part at least. Oh god. Yeah, I, um... Me and Papa were playing Black and White 2 as like a Nuzlocke Soul Link. And I have never played Black and White 2, so I already don't know what's happening, but especially don't know what's happening with a randomizer on. I'm throwing me off so bad. Oh 
God, I love this song so much. I'm glad I picked a song I like when I was doing this, because I listened to it a lot. Um, oh, Jesus. God, no, the Soul Link makes me so scared in particular, because it's just like... Uh, like, I don't want to... Like, if it was just me, it'd be fine. But the problem is that I'm also attached to Puppo for it. So if I get anything killed, it also kills Puppos, and I feel so bad about it. Is I check my chat? Also valid. Also, thank you, Cloudy. Yeah, this has been- oh, I'm so happy with how it turned out. It's made me so happy, and the reaction to it has been so positive from the people who are in it. Oh yeah, uh, the song title. Right. Also, I promise Demi's bit is coming, or Demi and the uh, Linux bit is coming up soon. Oh, yeah, there it is. Okay. The song is from the uh, Dong Rumble 1 anime. Uh, it's the outro music. That's the name of it. We're almost up to Demi and the Linux. It's the cuties. Yeah, don't worry, Demi. I have very much so already planned for if you kill anyone, it will absolutely incorporate the whole don't be suspicious. The hit someone with a pelican. We've watched like three times on stream already because I just, I. It makes me happy to see how satisfying the, like, the transitions are in bits. So many pretty designs. The same. Yeah, no, you guys. Oh my god, I can't believe you didn't even watch it in the mix. Yeah, you guys are in the same bit. Also, I said I'm gonna watch the whole thing, and then we did watch the whole thing. I'm sorry. In my defense, it, there's a lot, and it's cool, and I like it. Anyways, that's that. And then we've been making these, um. Fair enough. Your car or your card? Thank you. Yeah, so I've been making these for people. Demi, if you'd like one, I can make one for you too. I've always been having fun with this because they're silly and they're, they seem nice. Right, right, oh god. Yeah, we've got four of them are done today. The next will be the fifth. All this stuff is so fun to me. It's so silly. I'm not good at very many things, so I have to take what I can get. <laughs> do I have some fit? Wait, I do still have this pack. Okay, good. Um, where is the erase? Wait, is it? Oh, it's wind. That's right. I'm just a dumb little guy. Yeah, well, because it's not my assets. Like, I didn't make really, like, this sort of stuff. I didn't make. The, all of this was from a template. Uh, I linked it earlier, but I can link it again. So, like, anyone can make these. Obviously, like, I don't own this. Uh, but I was, like, making them for friends. And then, where do I position them next? I don't know why I put it in a rotate. That's not the right one. Um... And then minus 51 and 80. And there we go. My PayPal. Don't be silly. At least save it for when the simulation stream happens, because maybe you die first and you won't want to. Wait, where is. Hmm. Oh, right, I have Linux mirrored. I forgot about that because otherwise the tail gets in the way of the... <laughs> there wasn't a way to do it with Linux having space music at all on screen. Honestly, somebody killing you first would be the most like logical decision. Anyone who's watched you play Goose Goose Duck knows that like, if the goal is survival with Demi, you kind of have to swing first and swing fast. Yeah, I know. It's it's a little bit weird, but like 
I mean, I could probably... Because, like, if I tried to, I'd have to, like, position you kind of weird around it. So I remember I tried... There were a few people who I had to also, like, fuck around with a little bit. Um, I think Luciana was one. Where is she at? I also really like her design. It's so pretty. So many pretty people. Uh, project media is what we're looking for. Um, uh, look at this. I think the, t the like pails and stuff is really good. A lot of yeah. Um, what else are we talking? Oh, where's May in this? May's I really like, uh, May. There we go. Oh, so many pretty designs. Oh, that's what you meant. Yeah, no, definitely. The, like the it's a risk reward gamble with you because like on one hand yeah if you kill you then obviously like you can't uh you're safer but then you don't have demi to blame when everything goes wrong you can't use demi as your scapegoat if you kill demi but is that worth it um also i'm gonna hide these right now basically basically just drag both of them around to match actually let's go to the first position excuse me actually i need to run to the bathroom real quick i'll be right back I'll run the ad while i'm gone too anyways just make it a little bit easier see you in a sec i'll say yes take care of yourself demi i'm sorry i should have said that earlier Yes, get your food, get your water, get your rest if you need it. We'll still be here. Step away for half a second and there's fucking bots. I meant so many today too. Honestly, the real long con with all of this stuff is that I'm hoping that because I put the trailer on the VODs channel and all the like obviously all the streams of this are going to go up on the VODs channel as well so I'm really hoping that a bunch of people will go and subscribe to it so I can eventually monetize it <laughs> oh, people are weird anyway sorry got distracted okay um it's still showing right Yes, okay. Let me just... Probably afford to zoom you out a little bit more. Okay. So I'm gonna take you. 
Wait, what was the like lineup on this? Okay. I forgot already. What, what the fuck was it? Okay. I'm sure you'll get all figured out. Let's put you up here. I'm just turning your opacity on so I can see where I generally had that. I have that so high up on me in this one. I guess it's because it's like much larger more than anything else. I think that's basically where it's supposed to go. And then here. What did I have this at before, actually? That was at 252. So this needs to be like somewhere around there, I guess. No, this one. Let's see. that mm. oh right yeah i guess because you want the eye to eventually like actually show huh so maybe because i feel like it doesn't have the same effect if the eyeball doesn't show like the the it's kind of in the metric that I've been trying to go with, at least. And then we'll just set you guys both to here. That has to be the same position as before. 238. 238. 273. Holy shit, I can't type. There. And we'll add in the glitch blocks and we'll just kind of like see if that works, I guess. I don't know. Maybe a little bit off because it's not a head on piece, but it'll be close. Real quick, but let's see. How does the Nexus look? Oh, wait, I need to turn the opacity up. That's on me. That's a skill issue. And also, we can delete the rest of these because these don't need to be here anymore. So it doesn't try and render those in again. Because I'm dumb and I forget about a lot of things. All right, let's see. It's a little bit off because it's... Okay, Okay. so this time it skipped to J1. Why? Wait, is J1 after... J1's after Daz, but why does it skip here? Oh, I guess it's skipping to Joffy technically, but like, why? 
It's so weird. I don't know why it like picks the targets that it does. But anyways, Linux, if you're still here, what do you think? Because if you're not here, I'm just going to export this one and you'll get what you get. Actually, mm. yeah, no, Linux, you need to actually move a little bit more to the side during this. Otherwise, it doesn't really have the same effect. How much do this? I'll move you there. I'll move you like. No, if it needs to go down far. I might just peek out a little bit. I'll have to be fine. Yeah, I mean, as long as it looks like it doesn't have to look consistent with the others as much, it just has to look consistent with itself. So let's see. Maybe we'll do one for Demi, and then we might be done for today. I don't know. Maybe we'll do more of these down the road. We'll see. I kind of like that the guy just like peeks out for like a tiny little bit of time. That's kind of cute. Okay, I think we'll go with that unless Linux has a critique, a criticism, or a request. But if not, let's also let me just save real quick in case it crashes. And then we'll export. Hi, Brielle. How are you? Um, just making some fun little assets. Would you like a stinger as well? So far, we've made four today, I think. We made Linux, Linux Fubuki, Zabi, five, because Hikaru also got one. That's nice. All right, there we go. That's Lunex's. They're gonna do one for Demi as well. I've heard that gunshot noise a million times while I've been working on these. Yeah, if you'd like one, I can use the art they already have from, <clears throat> excuse me, the stinger or the animation thing I already got. <laughs> Yeah, let me grab Demi's stuff real quick. So I can do theirs. Ba -ba -ba. Where's Demi in that? Demi's right here, right? Yes. Oh, yeah, shit, we're listening to music. I forgot that I turned it off for whatever reason. background on there. And where's Demi's lines? So yeah, I know I said it before, but none of these are paid. These are just for fun. So if I was going to do them for money, I would have to like make sure that's okay with the person who made it, and I doubt it would be. Like made the uh, the lines and the ink and the layout of all of it, basically. You're easily impressed. Just thank you for the follow, Robin. Welcome in. Uh, let's grab Demi's name now. Uh, is it? It's just wind. God, I'm getting way faster this now. 
Okay, what can mean? Grab these. We'll put one at the end as well. Uh, these are... Um, for me, I mean, like, I had a webcam for the first however long while I was streaming. Um, like when I started making video essays and stuff again, um, the main reason I didn't keep doing it is mostly just like, it's stressful to have your face attached to everything you do and say online, especially like when you're playing games, because like you'll make an ugly face, you'll make a weird expression, you'll scratch at your nose and it'll look like you're picking it kind of thing. And I just also like, you just have to look much more presentable. Like I'm in my pajamas right now because I don't need to do more for this. And it's comfortable and it's nice. And that sort of thing just makes it a lot easier. Plus it's like, I've talked about it a few times. I view VTubing as very like, the screenshots are forever, that's true. But like for me, it's like, um, I think of my model as like a uniform I put on to work on anything. Like I view it the same way that I would view um, like putting on an apron to go work at Starbucks. Obviously it's not like, work in that way but like you know what i mean like you put on your uniform to go to work and then when you're done with work you take it off and then you get to go live your life and so me the real person this is way too big uh, uh actually it might not be too too big let's turn this down let's turn this off but like me the real person gets to go to the grocery store and like get food and hang out with people or do whatever i don't really hang out with any people because like i don't really have much of a social life here but like you know, I get to take it off and put it away and I don't have to like feel bad about myself related to it. But yeah, and so that was a big part of it for me. It was just like, because it is stressful. And like, I don't mean to say that I'm like big, famous, important person because I'm obviously not. But like, it does get very stressful very fast to be perceived by a lot of people. Let's see if this is better. Like the fifth video I put out was the uh, Blizzard doesn't understand survivorship bias video. And that one got, I don't know what it's at now, but it got like 200,000 views within the first like week or so. I had 90 subscribers and that was like kind of scary. It's a lot of like, it's even though now I've kind of mostly adjusted to that sort of thing. Oh, weird. Donation should be on the left side of my head. I think it's too big. Um, but yeah, I don't know. It gets stressful. People are commenting. People are having opinions about you, and it kind of came out of nowhere for me. So, VTubing was kind of a good way to like keep myself sane and also be able to still enjoy what I'm doing. I just feel like this is so. Oh wait, that's why. Duh. That's not really where it was lined up at all. Also, 265 is basically what this was, wasn't it? Yeah, it seems to be like 275. But yeah, that's sort of the main thing was just like, I wanted that sort of freedom to get away from it and put it down, especially because like, obviously it's not that serious. Like who really cares that much? But I also didn't want to go fully faceless because like people still do like to be able to put a face to a name, even if it's a, you know, anime digital face thing. Um, and so it, it kind of gets the best of both worlds where it's like people still can make that connection and it's still like a person and also comes with the advantage of like um what was it there's an old Lindsay ellis video where she talks about the nature of animation in musicals in particular and why uh animated musicals seem to work so much better for a lot of people than like on film specifically not like stage musicals but just in film um and one of the points she raises is that animation is like there's such an inherent necessity to separate yourself from reality like the or uh what's the word for it um i can't remember anymore either way like there's a very clear like line um that you don't have to stress yourself out about as much when it's animation because ever uh suspension of disbelief that's what i was thinking jesus i'm not very smart um but like 
if you want to have like a bit of a animation makes it easier for people to suspend their disbelief and just kind of like engage with it because if i had my face on here like i don't mean this to be negative about my appearance or anything like that i literally just made a like statement of fact if this was me like I, if if this was a human being instead of the vtuber model in this exact same spot with the exact same overlay like green screen up behind me so it looks the same it would kind of look a little bit weird because when you do too much especially as a smaller creator honestly it kind of i don't know it looks weird and it would look off-putting i don't look like this i don't look like neon twink vibes it's just not who i am and so like i couldn't have this kind of like branding stuff in that sense <laughs> hi reverie welcome in raiders hi hi how are you hi des welcome in welcome in i got a shout out uh reverie how are you doing what were you up to Red Dead Redemption 2. Nice. I still haven't played that one. I still kind of want to, but I've just never gotten around to it because I know it's a really in-depth one. But yeah, welcome in Raiders. My name is Vivros, a variety streamer. I play a whole bunch of stuff. Uh, a lot of shooters, a lot of visual novels. But right now, I'm just doing some fun editing stuff uh, related to excuse me, a Dongarampa simulation thing that I'm going to be doing that Reverie is also going to be part of. Wait, let me see if I, where's Reverie's in here. Um, hold on. I'll come back to that, in a, or that bit that we're working on with Demi in a second. Just got into a bar fight, as one does. Where are you? I think you're pretty early in here, correct? Why can't I find you? Uh, where? God, sorry, I'm a little bit blind. Oh, there you are. Never mind. Look at that. Yeah. Uh, if anyone would like to see the full trailer, oh, that's squishy. Uh, if you see the full trailer, it's in the pinned comment. Um, but yeah, it's been really, really fun. I was making a few of these little stinger things for people. Um, actually, let me make sure that Demi's is... Actually, Demi's kind of look mostly done. So I did delete that, right? Yes, okay. We'll check that out. And then um, who else did I say I was going to make one for? I don't know if Real wanted one. Maybe. But yeah, anyways. Oh, wait, why is Lunex is all... Oh, fuck. This didn't get dragged with it, did it? Fuck. Hold on, let me just see about this. I think it needs to be, like, on that line. Let me make sure that Lunex is actually, like, got to the right spot. Um... Also, yeah, right, if you need any food, water, rest, make sure you go do that. Self-care is important. If you like one of these stingers, I can see what I can do. Um, where is it? Um, it's the right length, so I don't think I fucked that up. I think it just happened when I moved it around. Um, but yeah, Demi's is... I like how that turned out. That was good. All right. Let me just export that for Demi. Export. Okay. Video. Uh, Demi Singer. Do, 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 do. Apply. Yes, yes, yes. There we go. But hi, Julian. How are you? All right. So we're gonna save here also before I forget. I'm doing good. I'm having fun making a bunch of these. Um yeah, bro, if you like one, let me know. Also, Julian, if you would like one of these, let me know. They function as like actual stingers. So like if you really wanted to, you could use them for that. Uh like on streams or whatever. I also I made one for myself because like I was streaming V3, so I was like, I might as well have it. Okay, sure, let me see. Where are you at in here? Um let me make a copy of mine again. Blah blah blah. There we go. Well, thank you. Yeah, I my big worry with the trailer was like I thought it looked cool, but I was terrified that it was gonna be a thing where it's like 
everyone looks at me weird like the kid who's doing like a naruto run in gym class and everyone's like i don't really know if that was necessary you know <laughs> like that was like my concern with it was that i was doing too much and that people were going to be a little bit weirded out so it made me very happy that everyone's been really liking it also i like how the glasses on yours kind of like have a unique like create the unique sort of glowing eye thing Okay, so let's see. Grab this, grab this. Yeah, if I do this again, which like, I feel like I probably will. It seems like people are having fun with it and like that's kind of the goal. Maybe I'll make it a donathon reward when I do it in October and we'll do another one next year. Um, but... Uh, yeah, I'll definitely like, now that I know what I want to do with it, I'll, I can be a little bit more clear with people like, oh, hey, this would be like a good PNG, like get a PNG that specifically is like facing forward or doing this or doing that. And then, uh, you know, because I feel like this time I was like, just submit a full body and I'll figure it out. And I don't know if that was the right way to do it because I ended up with a lot of very, it ended up being hard, but it also ended up looking cool. So it was all worth it in the end. I feel like the new Udo run it's not, I think people, like, people would still be probably pretty mean to you if you did it. I just think that people also know what it is more and are kind of, like, it's not like, it's known about more, but it's not necessarily liked more, like, you know what I mean? Um, Let's get the name now. Uh, Wind, wait, I didn't put the right one on this, yeah? Yeah, okay, good. And that's locked in there. Perfect. Right. Uh, opacity was the one that we needed to do. I don't know why is. Wait, no, this should be... I think they felt this on somebody that made it 80. And it shouldn't be, but whatever. Uh, 116 and negative 51. Oh, God. So that's the easy bit. So I can delete all of these real quick. I don't have a work ethic. I just get really fixated on stuff. The amount of things I need to do that I have not done, staggering. The amount of work I've done on this bullshit that doesn't matter, also staggering. <laughs> it's just how it goes. Okay. Uh, let's put you to... Uh, let me put you there for now. All right, so those are basically like centered on the eyes. Yeah, I mean, it is still something. I still enjoy it. It's just... I don't know. I always find it funny whenever I get a compliment from someone where they're like, wow, you have such a, like, because the work ethic one has come up a few times, especially like with the trailer. And I was like, I don't think that that applies to me. I don't think I'm working hard. I'm just dicking around and doing stuff. I think it has to be something that you're supposed, I don't know if I like, that looks a little bit, the two faces blending together is not a, I don't like, it looks like his eyes are on the side of like it looks like my eyes are on the side of my head because of where the glasses are. Oh no no no! We need to stop that right now. I mean, we need to keep lining it up that way because now I know what it looks like. Uh, 
257. 257. I don't really move very much, but that's okay. Yeah, that's a little bit of nightmare fuel, but it's okay. I'll delete those out of there for now. So we don't have to deal with that. And then turn the opacity on both of them up to 100. So now for this one. Maybe like 290 or something. I don't know. Actually, make it bigger. <laughs> Let's see. Let's do that. I appreciate the sentiment, but also, I sh <laughs> like with the video essays, for example, that's a good example of it in general, actually. Um, I started making those because I rant to myself in the car and I will rant about the same topic endlessly to myself unless I get it out of my system. So the reason I started making the videos was because I would get pissed about things and I either rant to myself or I rant to another person forever about it. That's not right. That needs to be way more vertical. Should not be going straight out. Uh, so I just made them to like free myself from the prison of my own creation. I think this one could also actually stand to be a little bit more. Oh, I just realized I'm also... Oh, fuck, both of these are blocking that, aren't they? Uh-oh, SpaghettiO. We have to work around that now, I forgot. And they start out blocking it too, which means that you need to move significantly further over and down. Are they blocking it here? Yes. It's too beefy and broad. Okay, what was the X on this one again? 614. Okay, I'll put it like negative 630. Uh, this, uh, oh, that's not correct. Uh. Have you seen that? Yeah, the um, first three rounds are going to be sort of uh, just each of the casts, and then the fourth one is going to be um, all stars rules, basically. I don't know why I managed to somehow put in an extra thing in there. It's not right. Oh, it was because I was fucking around with that. That's why. I see. So we're gonna You're easily impressed. Thank you for the follow, Carolyn. Welcome in. Uh program is uh Wondershare Filmora. This is a little bit janky. I feel like I made it way bigger for this. We'll figure it out. You're easily impressed. Thank you for the follow as well, BC Mallet. Um yeah, we'll render it, or we'll do the preview render and see. Yeah, I feel like there are, I've had a few friends since I started, like other VTubers or whatever, who've been like, yeah, I want to make like a video essay. And I'm kind of like, okay, but like, what do you want to make it about? And they'll be like, I'm not really sure. And I'm like, okay, so that's kind of the first thing is that I think in order to make any of that sort of stuff, you have to first believe that you have an opinion worth expressing. That one's a little bit, I mean, it's better doesn't cut off the word anymore so that's nice we'll move it just a little bit more that way and we'll move this one a little bit more over here we'll figure it out hey garnet how are you happy friday yeah i don't know i've had so much fun like 
once I put everything into this, I was talking about this earlier too. It, I did a few rounds of simulations because I wanted to make sure it wasn't just going to like pick all my friends and like have them survive because that would feel kind of cheap to everybody else. And also just wouldn't be as fun. I wanted to have some more random stuff. So I had to like rerun it because it would save my like, it'd be like five people that I like have known for a long time. And then one random person, it feels kind of, you know, it looks like favoritism, even though it's all randomized and like it's not actually my fault. So I would keep randomizing it until I got one that was fair and also didn't do a million double kills because the simulation also loves that shit. I think that one looks good. It definitely is harder with the, excuse me, the broader ones. Because I for mine, I use the, where is it, the smoogie one. Uh, and obviously like, Smoogie is a Dongromba character. She's skinny. She, you know, the framing doesn't really require her to fill a lot of space, whereas the beefier ones were definitely more difficult, but I like it all the same. Also, hi Tarth. How are you? Look at these. I'm making stuff. Also, just wait. Oh my god, it defaults to you. Oh, this is a sign. Look at Tarth's. Wait, does yours move? Why does it look like he's like slowly moving upward? Am I going insane? Am I going blind? But yeah, it's you. Um, can I remember if he said that they wanted a model or one of the stingers or not? I don't think, wait, did Brielle say? I can't remember what anybody has been saying. Um, I don't think Brielle did. Yeah, Tarth, would you like one of these? A little stinger? Gently floating away. Oh, that's fair. Also, not like this is like one chance for people to get these. I can make more of them in the future too. I'm just having fun doing it right now. So we'll export Julian's. Okay, so that. Yeah, I mean I'm not this doesn't take long to worry. This isn't like a hard one. I was gonna be done a little while ago, but we'll do a couple more. Uh, this bar daddy is Julian. Um, actually, I can keep using my commands for these. Julian. I make commands for everyone for when the streams are happening, when people die or when they kill someone, or just in general, so people can check and see who people are. Also, I just realized Julian's doesn't have pronouns on it. Weird. I need to fix that. Do more video editing. This is mostly just like silly little stuff though. This isn't like a big one. Um yeah, I don't know. What, I usually just copy paste it. Maybe Julian doesn't have the uh where is the credits thing? Oh, yeah, I don't, weird. Julian, it's he, him, right? And I'll let me know. So I'll just put it into the chat bot real quick. Any? Okay. Um. There we go. It should be updated now. Let's see there we go yeah because i wanted to include because also like there are a lot of people who have models where they're like you know either the model isn't uh the model isn't gender conforming or like they're not and so i like that or i wanted to have that in there just like also for my own sake to keep track of 57 people and make sure i'm not getting anything wrong so i feel bad but yeah so now we've got how many have we done today fubuki hikaru Nunex, Puppo, Zabi, Demi, and now Julian. We can do one for Tarth. Don't spam it too much because this is a pretty big block of text.
What was I looking for? I can't remember anymore. Yeah, Tarth. It also has the artist credit, which was like something I wanted to have because like there's not really a good way to have a hundred or so credits because like some people have multiple pieces of art for the whole thing. So yeah, everybody's got a command for them. Where's Tarth at? Actually, wait, I can probably just play the rest of this. Oh, now it's bringing me to silver. Why does it change? I don't understand this. It, oh, wait, no, it skips back or like, wait. I have no idea what that is anymore. Wait. Yeah, it doesn't make any sense. Whatever. Um, Tarth, where are you in this? Ooh, hi, hi, I made this piece specifically for this, and it's so pretty. I love it. Wait, where's the full body, actually? Hold on. Look at this. Isn't this so cute? Ah, I love it. Uh, where's Tarth in here? There's Tarth. Grabs you. Copy pastes you. Yeah, Hyatt did it all himself. Oh, Hyatt's so talented. Hyatt did a piece for me, like the lifeguard piece. Wait, I wonder if I can find it. Um, what's this piece? This will be one. Okay. Oh, I use... oh, I did see that. Yeah, I mean, I didn't look through it, but. It's hard to pay attention to Overwatch for me, honestly, a lot of the time. Just a little guy. Your Honor, he's just a little guy. Also, make actually copy paste. Um, wait, I just really did I fuck this up on the. Oh no, I mean that'll be the same. Okay, good. Thank God, I panicked for a second because I was like, wait, I didn't do this thing. Um, but no, where is it? The art from Haya. Haya's art. Uh, this one. Oh, let me just make this smaller. Uh, are there any for Venture? Uh, this is the piece of high I did for me. It was a YCH thing, but it was very good. I know, um, Bo got one, Krim is getting one. Yeah, of course they would never get one to... You know, venture. Why would they? Why would they even care about their new heroes? <laughs> Hi, Blueberry. No need to apologize. I'm happy to have you whenever I can, but I hope that your work is going good. And hope you're getting your rest where you can. Yeah, thank you for stopping by. I appreciate it. Mwah. Okay, um... I feel like they haven't really done that many for... They haven't done as many as I would have thought they would for Juno, honestly. I kind of thought they would do more. Purely because she seems like she would be a very, like, Tracer-esque hero, but she kind of hasn't been. Also, I realize her colors are very similar, but that's okay. Also, this means you have to play Donnarumma Tarth. I'm making you. It's illegal to not now. It'd be rude. You have to join the brain rot. Because what else would you use the stinger like this for? Hi, Kumi! How are you? Oh my god, but you also like a stinger. And making all these things for people. It's one of these. Was a full playthrough of one. Ooh. Oh, I should say there's an ad. <laughs> Sorry, I should have paused it. When the ads over, I'll have to ask Tarth where it was. Never played it. Oh my god, you should. Develop mental illness with the rest of us. Hey, how are you doing, Gumi? I've just been sitting around making these all day. Uh, I think that's where that needs to line up. Yeah, yeah. You don't have any night. What kind of donut? Sorry, I need to eat some food soon. Uh, 
pass it down to zero and then 250 here. Trigger Happy Havoc. Oh, yeah. I mean, that's the first. The first one is like fine. I think that the main weakness of the first one is that it doesn't really. It's still figuring. It's like finding its footing. And so there's a lot of things that it doesn't do as well as the other ones. I will still defend V3. Everyone else can fight me. I like that yours doesn't look that different from mine just because it's the same basic color scheme. Also, I think there is actually an ultimate explorer, but I think it's a spoiler to say who it is. Also, for, yeah. Dawn Marvel 2 has some moments of, or Dawn Marvel 1 has some moments that really do not age well. Mostly in chapter 2, really. <laughs> Just. There's very bizarre decisions being made all around, but whatever. It happens. Okay, so we're going to do what we've done the last few times because this worked actually pretty well, I think, for organizing everyone. Yeah, Dharma fans are a problem. The series is also a problem. It's a blight on the world, but Dharma fans are a bigger problem. Oh. Actually, wait. We'll do this to save myself the headache of trying to reorganize it after. There we go. And then we need to drag you. Line up the chin, basically. But yeah, I don't know. I think they're good. They're good games to like just kind of dick around with. Uh, oh god, where did I put this out before? Hold on. I was already at 300, yeah. So we'll put this up to like 315, I guess. I don't know. I'm getting more and more ambitious with how we're doing sizing here. I mean, chapter two is the, I don't know, weird gender stuff. Handled with all the sensitivity of a fucking Mack truck. Because what else would you expect? Okay, so now we got the shadow. Maybe like 315 or whatever. Do that. And then, wait. Okay, that's why I'm dumb. Uh... Oh, wait, is it the size that I made this one? Is that why it's doing that? Oh, that is why it's doing that. Okay. So, 330, I guess. Let's see if we can't get at least one eye out there. Yeah, doesn't do mental health well either. This is mostly right. We'll see. I mean, there are a lot of fans who are just like, I don't know. Dong Rapa is weird in a lot of ways because it's also like, I mean, obviously, like, it's a really engaging premise. Like, clearly, people just like death games and killing games. Like, they're just kind of fascinated with them in general, which I made a whole video about that actually. Wait, where is it? It was what's up with media about kids and killing games from last November, actually. Jesus, it's so long ago. If you'd like to check that out. Oh, 
Or have you move over a little bit more here? Oh, isn't that? Sweet? I kill. I mean, hang on, girl. God damn. And thanks for the stuff. How you doing? Look a man. Oh my god. Five months. How the time flies. Also, <laughs> shock that Twitch continues to allow me to have that emote. I'm sure it's going to eventually make me delete it, but we'll enjoy it while we have it. Alright, let's see. That works, I think. Oh my god, and it zooms back to you in the... Wow. That looks good. Uh, they are from November. I don't know if it follows the clothing guidelines. I don't know if it does really anything appropriately, but it is what it is. I'm pretty sure that I've seen people get less egregious stuff taken down. We'll see. I feel like if it was one of those things, if they knew about it, it would probably get taken down, but they're not going to like... It's not so bad that like an automatic filter would catch it, you know? Anyways, let's export Tarths. Um, it's beautiful. Yeah, it's very good. Let's see, I'm so happy with the trailer. Thank you, Kill. Yeah, it's been. It's just made me so happy that people have generally liked it because I. I've said it before too, like I was really worried that the reaction to it was gonna be like, oh no. Well that's not. Was I Tony? Okay, so I can't remember if anyone else had asked for one. Who else was here? Uh I should have just like Yeah, no one else said they wanted one. So I might just leave it there. We can always do more of them. I'm not gonna like stop doing these if people want them in the end but we've made Papos, Hikaru's, Zabi's, Fubuki's, Lunex's, Demi's, Julian's, and now Tarth's. So that's pretty good for today I feel like. That was fun. Yeah. Uh, also I'll send you guys all those ones um, once I'm off. I can't like send them through Discord. I'll have to put them on like a Google Drive because or yeah a Google Drive folder thing because they're like 300 megabytes each for three seconds because of the transparency so you can use them as an actual stinger but oh cool i love how i uh, everything is crashing because i tried to load a file that i've already opened multiple times today that's so cool i'm glad to hear you're doing good yeah we're doing well but yeah i've shown it a few times already to actually let me just do this adjust the track height and make it small so you can see it better. This is the abomination of the trailer's uh, editing thing. How dare I load a file? Yeah, Wondershare for more doesn't like it when you load files. It also doesn't like it when you just play the video. Like, this bit, it can't handle this. And this is just like one new PNG every frame for like 30-something frames. Which, to be fair, is a lot. But still, like, look. It's all, like, the preview render is done. And now it broke. It got one square done. It tried its best. Its best just kind of sucks. Oh god. I I love how this little revolver... I did the revolver in different colors for each group. It's so like the Fall of Hope got autumn colors. The Frozen Frenzy Winter group got this. And then where is the one for the... The Despair Downpour group one wasn't on for very long because it was just sort of a shorter one. But they got sort of a blue and a green. Also, I just realized, is that... Please tell me I didn't fuck that up. Hold on. I did fuck that up. Uh-oh. Because this is not supposed to be a normal blend mode. This is supposed to be a color burn. Thankfully, it's very small and it's barely on screen. So nobody will notice and you guys won't tell anyone. I'll just save that. <sighs> can't believe I noticed that I fucked it up. Whatever. It's such a small... It's that little, like, the blue ring right outside of the revolver barrel. It's supposed to have a different texture. But it's on screen for a grand total of... I think less than two seconds. So it'll be fine, I guess. 
I'm not going to re-export it. This is going to be a better version that only exists on my computer. Like that's how long that lasts and it takes ages to make. God, I like how that turned out though. I'm so happy with all of it. It turned out so good. Like this. Oh, hey, it's starts again. And this bit that took 8 million years to put together because it's just everyone long. Ugh. I don't know. It turned out so good. I'm so happy other people have been okay with it too. Anyways, you save that. Uh, let me stop sharing the screen for a second. Where is Filmora? There we go. Who's pinging me in here? I don't know. Okay. Uh, mine's going to be in the final one. So the way it's going to work, there's 19 people in each group. Uh, there will be six survivors from each one, including one mastermind from each one that will have a special function once we get to the extra or the survive or the all stars round. And then all 18 of the survivors will join me for the all stars round. It'll be very fun. It'll be very silly. I'm hoping it's kind of like a creative writing exercise as much as anything, but I hope people enjoy it. Um, what was I going to do? Uh, I don't know what else there is to do. Kind of might be. I mean, watch the trailer one more time. Right, put the trailer on one more time while I go and get some more water, and then we'll find someone to read out to. Let me just see here, really quick. Mm hmm. Yeah, okay. I'm gonna run, grab some water and stuff. Ooh, shit. Wait. Okay. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna play the trailer one more time before we're done because I like it and I wanna watch it again. I like the song. And also, I'm gonna just drink some water and find who we're gonna raid. Because uh, I don't need to go. I feel bad if I left right now. I'll just we'll snooze the ad because fuck it. Fuck it, it's fine. Where is it? Uh, there we go. Okay, let's see who can raid. Who's live? I haven't. Okay, we're gonna read out to Tenchi after this.
Honestly, I think I like it more as time goes on because I'm not having to watch it through the frame by frame of editing it. <laughs> Nothing will make you hate everything you're doing more than having to go through it and edit it. It's miserable. so much i'm so happy that it turned out but anyways okay as we're gonna end it because also it's been almost four hours jesus i was gonna end it an hour ago yeah okay um we're gonna read out to tenchi vt who's playing what's tenchi playing i think it was honkai yeah so we'll read out to tenchi and yeah thank you guys for watching whether you've some of the oh wait raid messages uh raid one this one's for subscribers um let me copy paste my own raid message because otherwise i will forget and raid two for everybody else yeah thank you for watching i hope you've enjoyed i hope it's been fun i don't know if i'll really do very many editing streams in the future or anything like that but this was a good time i had fun with this um tomorrow we might do some Marvel Rivals, I'm not sure. Sunday is going to be karaoke and like some games. I don't know what we'll play. We'll probably do community games. We'll see. Um, terrified for the karaoke. That's been a really fun thing to have hanging over my head for this whole thing. Um, but yeah, that'll be happening too. Very excited. Very terrified. Yeah, I hope everyone has a good night or whatever time zone you're in. And I'll see you when I see you. Goodbye. Against the head attention for me. Bye.